Hey, it's your boy DJ Chad here on the Chad Couch. I'm here with a notable rapper and uh, the recent victim of a home invasion, except <laughs> he fired back. Uh, give it up for one, Mr. Ben Barson. Ben, thanks for joining us. That's right, I'm here in the building. You know, niggas try to heat me, twin, but they can never defeat me. I was in my crib. You want me to tell you, you want to hear the whole story, Chad? Yes, I, you, you said right, you right. had to shoot someone? Yes, niggas was about to get clapped. Listen to this. I'm in my crib, Candy's whipping up some yams in the kitchen with her titties out. I hear a knock at the door. I'm in the middle of replacing an iguana cerebellum with that of a gopher. I'm very rapt. I hear the door. It's a knock on the door. Knock, knock. I go down to the door. Before I go to the door, do you know what I do, Chad? What do you do? I grab the Draco, nigga. I go to the door with the motherfucking Draco. That's what I call it. I hear the knock. I open the door. It's a masked man. Really? He pushed me in the crib, Chad. He pushed me down. I looked up. I seen the same face of Jesus that I saw when I robbed that Popeyes. Excuse me, when I stopped the robbery at Popeyes. Mm. Whew, give me a second to compose myself. Take your time. I know it's traumatic. <sighs> Candy, hold me. She still yeah. has a titty out. Yeah, it's beautiful. Look at that nipple. I think it's a Hershey kiss. They're like gumdrops. Whew, they're beautiful. So I pull out the Draco. Shoot the nigga. Bang, bang. Dead. I, he has a mask on. I pulled the mask off. You knew who it was? I knew who it was. Who was it? Motherfucking Mr. Brexit. He looks up at me. He says, Chad, I come to your crib to invade it, trying to help you build a wall. You shoot me. Chad, my Donald Trump is impeccable, by the way. Wow. He looks at me. He says, damn. Nigga. Then I shoot him. Pow, pow. You shoot him again? I shot him again. You know what I'm saying? Make sure he was expired. I hear another knock at the door. The door's open. I don't know why it's knocking, so I go back downstairs. It's another masked man. He takes out his Draco. He starts shooting. Pow, pow. I'm hit. Pow. Ooh. I, I, I get low. But you know, I'm a surgeon. I'm a neurosurgeon. I know how to do these things. So I neurologically remove the scalpel bullet. Whew. I make a run for the door. I shoot the nigga. Pow, pow. He gets hit in the chest. Pow. He falls. He's dead now. What's going on right now? Chad, pass me one of them zannies. All right. Bodega Boys, episode 51, suck my motherfucking dick from the rear. Do the motherfucking trap, nigga. It's been bossy. You know what time it is. Live from Red Bull Studios, New York. He's dead up. <laughs> Start in 2017. Strong. Yo. It's the art tale on a Friday, a late edition. The lit Louvre. The lit battle. Give it you know up for Kid Mero. You, get know it, you gotta get nominated for something. For Yo, like, let me get a Golden Globe. Let me get a Golden Globe. He's something? gonna get like a Bronx Golden Globe. <laughs> What's the popership? Is it a Golden Globe? That's like it's the gonna most... be hold that B Plaza. <laughs> It's gonna be you and fucking Dean Meminger from New yo, York One. That basics for gear and shit. Like, yo, it was good. All the food was provided by Little Napoli's in Section 5. Little Napoli's, where we powderize the foley's. Yo, it's episode 51. That's right. Bodega Boys in the building. It's your boy, Jesus Nice, a.k.a. Jesus Rice, right. Young Chipotle. Oh my a.k.a. God. Poxy, Fat Like Terio, like a.k.a. Chris Stapps for slaying the cow. Damn. Eli Lippy, Boochers, Mr. Scully, Slow That Might Know You, Bitch, Young Gay oh Party, Young Hot Take, DJ Fuego, yeah. Mr. Nando with the Rondo, Me on the Vasa Terri Vata Equato, Nikhil Golvin off, The Juve Boss, <laughs> MC Liquid Gunga P, Put Up for 40 with your shorty, a.k.a. Don't Talk To Me No <laughs> I don't know you. I don't know you. Ah. The original my plus one got a plus one. So don't make a fuss on the Don't listen. make a scene here. Look, look through the names. Look, at, just check it again. It's, D's is nice. D plus one. E S. No Z, no Z. There's an exponent. Yes. And there's another plus one. There's a dash on the S. They're with me. <laughs> they need a gift bag. <laughs> Dina's Rossi is a Jamaican Jew. Jermaine Avocado Toast. Young <laughs> The ghost of Mufasa. Simba, take care of your mother and don't let her be a dot. Young Jacoonery without the coonery. <laughs> and Kate Chili Lamone, the left handed reliever for the Yankees. Que lo que. Oh. We used to get skied up in 1985. Papi, Let's see. We wasn't using God gnomes. Well, who was that? That's for the Pandejos. <laughs> Vice Game, <laughs> who's that guy? Tufo Jones, aka 3, thanks to the pet oh. Jesus Ed Machina, aka Jay Chuckles off the turnbuckle, aka oh, your man Stanley Cups, aka Mr. La Marina and Mesh Marina, where Freshman's Vina and Codemina, Leonardo DiCaprio, aka Mr. 234 
pee. Hey, cause I like my pino blurry. <laughs> AK DJ Woolley, AK, you're listening to Wash the Fat. fucking washed. Your problematic bay. Uh, wow. Welcome to 2017. Oh my god, it's the new year, nigga. You know who Woo. it is. It's the motherfucker, the god, the kid Merrill, you know what I'm saying? The human durag flap, curve Gotti, Trius Khalifa! You know what I'm saying? Skirt loader! I know fucking baby, my nigga, I fucking mean. You know what I'm saying? Yo. <sighs> Big smack, be yumbo, you know what I'm saying? Big smack. Dad of the air, you yeah. know what I'm saying? I'll open your medicine cabinet, you know why? Because I'm the Zen man. Rico Sabroso is my Stevie B, you know what I'm saying? If you steal my and target, respect my agency. Approach me like an earthside mammal, like a you know what I'm saying? Rico Sabroso, feel the ass Tyson. Woo. The Dominican Dada, pulling up from three, who is it? Barmelo's Anthony. Oh, jab, jab, step, let's go. Yeah, fedora. Woo. <laughs> the boys are back in town. That's right, nigga. The, 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 the boys are back in town. <laughs> Episode 51, you hear the crystal clear clarity. Oh, we're coming man. to you live from West 18th Street. Oh, Red Bull Studios, mm. the mecca where we make this fire fucking art. Mm-hmm. Welcome to the new year. You survived. There was no Y2K thing. That's right. Nothing shut down. Donald Trump was not able to destroy the world before 2017. Not yet. He still got the fire tweets. He's, he took it off his vision board. He was tweeting this morning about the ratings for The Bachelor, and everyone was like, yo, do you want to see what? these secretary briefings? Like, <laughs> ISIS is kind of moving out of... He's like, look, look at these ratings. Look at this. Schwarzenegger. Niggas ain't even getting roses out here. He's whack. <laughs> <laughs> he has nigga in his name. Can't prosper. Sad. Sad. Might take the mic back. <laughs> Gonna take away his Rockefeller chain. <laughs> oh, man. I don't know yeah. what is going on. It's a wild boy. Yo, I don't know how many episodes this podcast is left because... <sighs> The one day we gonna wake up with a wild mushroom cloud, like, oh, damn. damn I should have said, you gotta start waking up at 6 a.m. when he starts tweeting. Because if you wake up at 7 a.m., it might be too late. <laughs> you might just yeah. see that hellfire missile coming yeah. out. Like, you can just start reading his tweets over loudspeakers in your hood, like, <laughs> yes. in a truck driving around. Donald Trump tweeted today. Sad. We are now at war. <laughs> You're just gonna find out every day, like, oh, shit. Oh shit! I told you Obama was from Kenya. Kenya was fucking shady. Told you niggas, it's about to get popping. He's gonna read some fake news, just fire off the wall. Like it's gonna be something like more benign, like something like no, ISIS hates his steaks. He's like, fuck ISIS, y'all wild pussy. Yo, fuck, I dare you, I dare you, I dare you to blow something up. I dare you to blow up a major city in America. You don't have the balls. What are you doing? What are you doing? And MSNBC's gonna be like. This is a provocative way of being presidential. <laughs> Unprecedented. Unprecedented. Is he leading from the front? Aggressive. <laughs> oh, we're so Anti-establishment. Much wow. Bucking it's trends. Morning Joe. Oh, you saw your man Morning Joe. Did you see Woo! Morning Joe is caught out there? Woo! They had him at the party. And he was, uh, they had him at the party, like the New Year's party. He's hobnobbing with Donald Trump. Ooh. And then he got all tight on Twitter, like, yo, I was just passing through. Niggas was at party. Ah, right, nigga. They showed, they showed him throwing they're it up. They showed him like, like, yo, this nigga was dabbing with him. This nigga was two stepping in the band of bougie. Mika Brzezinski was right there, like, yo, Ray yeah. drops. Drop drops. Drops. Ah. Listen, yo, he was yeah, alone. Yeah, he was out yeah. there. Yeah. They were looking like Odell Beckham on the dance floor. <laughs> Stop it! Fuck out of here! He was like, I was home with my kids. Fuck out of here! He was like, we got that, we got the evidence. You got dirt on you, doggy. He got caught throwing. Everyone gets caught every now and then. Sometimes somebody, somebody is minding their business and mm-hmm. taking their little Snapchat, and they mm-hmm. happen to catch you in the back, back of it. Back. And now you got some expensive to do, Lucy. Come on! You said you was going to bed at eleven. <laughs> well, I see you doing the hot two step of Don Coquille at one thirty. You know what I'm saying? What's really good? What's going on? With Donald Trump passing the hookah with no mouthpiece uh-huh. out here, <laughs> Man, right throwing up gang like, signs like yo, <laughs> Mercy Alago, Ah, yeah. Lago. Out yeah. here, MSNBC gang, Mika Brzezinski, you know she'll be here doing bong rips and shit. Come on. <laughs> Niggas throw it up in the parking lot, you put videotaping the shit. You know, ah, yo, ah, we out here, squad, nigga. The champagne bubbles tickle my nose, Joe. <laughs> That's the yay, bitch. <laughs> <laughs> oh, what's going on with the world? That's Joe. That's the nigga with the weird glasses, right? The little circle glasses? Who? Uh, Morty one, Joe? What's his name? Uh, I don't even know his name. Joe Scarborough. Scarborough. Yeah, he wow. used to be like a congressman fan. or something. And like now, he used to be a congressman. Yeah, man. Wow, what a word. And now he has a show sponsored by Starbucks. Wow. Shut Get it? You. Morning, Joe. Uh-huh. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Speaking of great corporate plays, salute. Real nigga of the week. The person that writes the tweets for Yahoo oh, Finance. Oh, shit, yes. Yo. Yo. Son, you know what's so ill when you see, like when you just fucking smack sitting around, mm-hmm. like looking at Twitter and you, and you see, see some shit happen in real and, time? And you're just like... This is going to be this something. Is, I yeah. saw that tweet and I was like, <laughs> okay. <laughs> I just went upstairs. I got another beer. 
<laughs> rolled up my L, <laughs> smoked. I said, It'll be, it'll be, they'll take it down to five minutes. Yeah. I came back. Yeah. I was like, yo, it's been 20 minutes, <laughs> my nigger. <laughs> Like, you're really gonna leave that up? Yo, the shit was rocking for Mad Long. Yo, for those who don't who don't say, no, no, it, the tweet said it was a. A Yahoo Finance suit about Donald Trump. Trump. It he's said Donald fr- Trump wants a bigger n- navy. But the bigger. They said the bigger, he they put the N word. Nigger. You know what I'm saying? Which was funny because it said Trump, so I didn't know if it was an actual tweet or not. I was like, <laughs> I was like, damn. Damn. Really he not damn. even he not even sugarcoated it's it damn. now. What have you got to lose? Listen. Since bigger just joined the navy, my nigga. Listen. It was really good. <laughs> Like, I'm telling you, niggas, you got food, you're on a boat. I know you niggas can't swim. It's lit. <laughs> it's lit. It's like you can wear white. Chill. I'm like, yo, why you hanging, What happened? Man? What happened last time? Last time you got on a boat, it ended badly. Take another chance. Come on, what do you got to lose? You got on Listen, boats now, what's the worst? I'm the only motherfucker that's going to put you on a boat out of here. You feel me? So, holla. <laughs> <laughs> they got fucking flamed. <laughs> yo. They got flamed. Shout out to all, like, the white people that was watching it. Like, I can't get uh, in on the damn, fun. Damn. Looking like double dutch when they can't jump in. Like, ah. Like, like they're too slow. Ah, ah. Oh. I can't rock. Ah. The nigga Navy. <laughs> That's scary. Yo. It's a nigga Navy. But yo, shout out to uh, who was hoping to hit me yesterday. Uh, Ari Alexander, you know what I'm saying, reporter guy. I forgot who you report for, but you popping. Uh, he was like, "Yo, that's as a as a white guy, that's the scariest thing to do to mistake to make because it's like the B and the N are right next to each other yeah. on the on the keyboard. I got, so you fuck up and you, you just hit up. send and just out here. And you know what the thing is? Like, I gotta see who writes the tweets for Yahoo Finance because it's one thing if it was like I got oh the dude. I'm thinking it's like yo. I'm thinking it's like me back at the, my office job where I was like fuck. I'm uh, off. Ah, I'm off of work. Uh, Let me just schedule mad tweets. Da, 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 da. Schedule, schedule, out schedule. Out, out of here. <laughs> out of here drinking a La Marita in the lobby taking off my tie like ah uh-huh. fuck this place da, da. <laughs> so he's just sleeping and the phone is like <laughs> just rotating vibrating all over the phone it's just dancing like Chris Brown and, and shit. he's just looking at all the emails and just exclamation points and then, t- and then t- you're like fuck fuck <laughs> <laughs> Please handle immediately. <laughs> ASAP. ASAP. Got the wild. Top of the list. The, the meeting the next morning, everyone's just like, yo. no one make eye contact with you. Like, yo, damn. damn like, people were talking. You walk in, they're like, people stop talking. Like, oh, oh shit. Oh, here, here he comes. <laughs> like, it's a surprise to see you and shit. Like, <laughs> Niggas, oh, oh. You, your ID still works. Oh, shit. Wow. Oh, you came in. Damn. Okay. Oh, you dressed what up, you... too. Like, you not about to move a box? You not a... <laughs> wow, fam, you yeah, already man. took your stapler. Like you seen the tweet, right? You seen it? <laughs> I, we all seen the tweet. <laughs> I printed it out. That's just on my wall. Like we used to go to lunch together, but I, I didn't know it was like that, my nigga. <laughs> I thought you was BLM. <laughs> He's like, no, they're right next to each other. Yo, my God. Like, I ate too much. I ate too much shrimp on New Year's. My fingers. I have goiters. I have the gout. My fingers swell up. I got chubby fingers. <laughs> I'm using a MacBook Air. I'm using a MacBook. <laughs> yeah. Oh, it's Shout so out possible. Shout tweeting from web. Listen, got to hear both sides, Get how you live. Got to hear both sides. He could get a good interview, whoever it is. <laughs> he, yeah, her. Yeah. You know? Uh-huh. that You could do a whole CBS fucking sitcom based on that. Come on. Like, that person gets fired for doing a wild racist Oops. tweet. And then she there's like some lily white girl. And she has to go home to her <laughs> black husband. He's just sitting on the couch like, Beth. Come on, Beth. Beth. For real, Beth? Come on. She's like, she's like, I had chubby fingers. Oh, got the on. laugh track. Jamel, you don't have chubby fingers. Come on. <laughs> I told you don't give me any more Shiraz. Oh, shucks. <laughs> it's a Shiraz. Oh, man. <laughs> Shout out to everybody that got twisted off the Shiraz this New Year. How was your New Year's? Oh, man, it was fucking nuts. I ate shrooms. <laughs> <laughs> Watched movies. And they counted down. It was wild. Wow. I, I, I. You know how you eat shrooms and you feel good? Yeah, yeah. And then you eat shrooms and you're like bugging? Uh-huh. I was bugging. Uh-oh. But it was like good bugging. It was controlled bugging. If you're going to bug out, bug out in your crib. Because you, know you, know you, you know the perimeter. You know that everything's, everything's going. You know what I'm saying? So you're not going to lose your mind. Like at a fuck holiday party. You know what I'm saying? Which I feel like we talked about already. Right. So I'm not going to revisit. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I'm going to revisit that scary oh, yeah, time. We, I forgot that. I forgot that. We were like, shmizz <laughs> that advice. Shout out to Vice Land. Our show coming back on Monday. Lit. You probably hear, should hear this before this. You know Can't wait. Next. A lot of stuff been happening in the news. Oh, Everyone so hitting much. us up. When you guys come back? When you guys so come much back? Stuff. I mean, it's cool. It's a TV show. Jesus and Mero. Holla. 11 Numbers p.m. is great. Monday, Tuesday, Amazing. Wednesday, Thursday, 11 p.m. on Viceland. That's right. On SBS if you're in Australia, mate. Oh, shit. 
Shout out to Australia. Yeah, that's right. Shout out to Sky TV if you're in England. New Zealand. New Zealand. UK. We're all over the place. You know, you got you to gotta, you gotta keep yourself humble. So right. you walk into the street like, yo, I'm all over the place, daddy. <laughs> I'm all over the place. Look at all the buses in D.C., man. Yo, out of here, bro. I'm here. And, um, this is the jack-off hour. Yeah. <laughs> it's just Felicio and you know <laughs> Yo, what is that, bro? Terra chips? Listen, yo, Rebel be having the Rebel got the good chips. Yo, Rebel got the good chips. This is a perfect. I was saying earlier, I was like, we could be recording this shit in my cousin's bathroom in the projects with egg cartons on the <laughs> wall. You know what I mean? Like, yeah, the, fucking, to, the pantyhose on the hanger in front of you know the mic. I mean? and shit. Every now and then, you see him lift up the MacBook. I'm like, what's the matter? He's like, Roach. Yo, you know shit. what I mean? <laughs> I don't want to live that life. <laughs> God bless Red Bull. Yo, Roach is in the USB, man. Hold up. Go, Joe. It's in the Serato box. <laughs> when I shake it, you can hear it rattling. <laughs> I don't know if you can bring it to the club. Yo, you don't want to bring a Serato box to the club and have a roach call out. Vash, you're going to see it and be like, yeah, yo, what the fuck? Yo, yo. Yo, yo. This guy roach it. Chill. Y'all niggas is nasty. <laughs> like, someone got to, you got to get a vinyl record just to scratch it. Like, <laughs> Excuse me. Yo. This is a message from management. Please do not bring roaches into the venue. Roaches in there like, yo. No outside roaches allowed. Yo, play remix to Ignition, baby. Yo. Yo, yo, you got that young M.A. shit? Yo. What's that shit with Remy? Is she spitting? Ooh. That other shit. Yeah, wait, wait, wait a minute. Yeah, 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 I love that. Yeah. That's my shit, yo. Yo, throw that on, my yo, nigga. Yo, nigga, still some boring crowd on me, but I'm still walking, fuck though. Fuck it, fuck it. Fuck it, I'll walk with a limp, though. I'm yo. still good. <laughs> yeah, Roach right. gang, nigga. I'm right. <laughs> Roach gang. Niggas ate my cousin and some egg rolls last week. <laughs> Sick mom, nigga. Yo, niggas ate my cousin. <laughs> yo, he fell in deep fry, you know what I'm saying? It was yeah, quiet, man. Nigga was a fighter, though, you know what I mean? Nigga tried to swim out. You know, he got stuck on some cabbage. <laughs> Mrs. Swan pushed it back down in the oil. Dude didn't even want the egg roll, but I'm saying, when you get the general salads, it come for free, daddy. Ooh, you know what I mean? Shout out to Sal the Roach. Yo, Just living Sal. his best life out there. I hear rocker. Okay. Speaking of living your best life, i seen a picture of Gucci Mane in a full mountain bike suit, riding a mountain bike in a beautiful, lush green background. I was like, damn, bro. He's living yo, a life. Yo, that's so ill, because that's the first thing i ever seen ever in life that came home from jail and, and did prospered. Better. And, and prospered. did better. <laughs> like, Everybody yo. comes home from jail and like, yo, I'm going to do better. But, <laughs> you know, after the first couple of three weeks, it's like, yo. 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 Like, yo, listen. <sighs> Time to get this pack off. <laughs> <laughs> listen, these Farragamo belts are going to pay for themselves, you know Ma. You know what I'm saying? This bitch want to go to the movies and, you can't be the nigga. and cheesecake I used to, every weekend. You can't be the nigga. <laughs> I used to get the brick from a 95, and now I see you working a 9 to 5. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> no. I'm going to see you on the... I'll be like, yo, Poppy? No. You on the 4 train? So what? You like, that, that's plaster on your that's, face? Uh, damn, that's the first time I've ever seen you with your shirt buttoned all the way up, Poppy. Oh, you damn. do construction? <laughs> wow. Damn. Oh, damn. All right, man. Well, stay up. Damn. So you don't got them things on no Didn't you used to have a pet tiger? <laughs> <laughs> I have to give it away, papi. You're seeing Dominican right now. He's with my cousins. I mean, you used to have a go play the AK 47 in the papi. Heights. I still got it, but. You live I, on 80 Avenue now in the, yeah, in the, in the basement? Yeah, in the Bronx? You know, but it's cool. I got cable. You know, I have a good package. Oh, I got telemicro. You don't have direct TV? Uh, no, no more, you know. I don't have no more satellite. Damn, nigga. You washed. I washed, papi. <laughs> coño. I'm going to jump in front of the fucking train. <laughs> <laughs> now, wait for the next one. Wait for the next one. I'll take this one home. <laughs> You don't even try to stop the nigga and be like, yo, I know you're going through some things, my G. I'm just saying, if you jump in front of the Express, Ooh. it's probably going to do the job. Yes. The local, you know, yeah. we just take it our time. It pulls into the station. You know what I mean? mean? <laughs> Matter of fact, if you don't like Mexicans, why don't you go do it in front of one of the trains going to Queens? You know what I mean? Fuck that day up. Yeah. Oh, People shit. should jump in front of trains in front in the neighborhoods of the racial group they hate the most. That's real racism. That's the that's real racism. That's ultimate racism. You gotta die with hate in your heart. <laughs> Yo. Like listen, I don't like Russians. You're willing to risk it all. I'm going, I'm going to Brighton Beach. <laughs> Fuck that. Ride the train two hours with yeah, a frown on my face. Yeah. Like I, right, I got y'all. Your borscht is gonna be wild cold. G- got y'all, comrade. <laughs> <laughs> no one going to Century Twenty One tonight. Fuck y'all. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, yeah. okay. The problematic light is on. Yo, this is blinking. Fuck it. It's twenty seventeen. It's twenty seventeen. There's no much. To, there's no. The facts don't matter. No. Problematic light don't matter. You can say whatever you yo. want. You can say whatever yo. you want. Yo, so, listen. Uh, my if son Donald Barry, Trump tweeted tomorrow that yo, we're going back to calling pussy cock. That's it. Listen, you gotta lo- do it. It's, it's back to the seventies. It's law. It's L A W. Yo, fucking Barry got two weeks left, man. Damn. It's the final countdown. The final. Shit is. Countdown. Shit is actually mad sad. I seen that shit. And I was like, damn, fourteen. That's. Damn, that's two weeks. Yeah. Then, this, then fucking Cheeto becomes president. And that nigga might press the red button on the first day. 
Just you, to test you, it. You never know. Just to, you know what? It's like <laughs> it's where like Cordy Dick's in the hood get a gun. You know what I'm saying? As soon as they get it, they start firing the air. Pow, yeah. Let me see this shit work. Pow, 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 yeah. Pow. Yo, relax. Come on, fam. Come on, Chauncey. You making a block hot, nigga? Making a dumb hot. Nigga, it's 8 o'clock. I just started smoking. They got the (sighs) fucking shot spotted. Come on, bro. Nutcracker no nigga ain't even here yet, stupid. Mm-hmm. Now I gotta go inside. <laughs> oh man, fuck you gotta it go up. inside and play fucking egg 2K mm-hmm. for 12 hours. You look outside the windows, mad cop cars. <laughs> Cops ain't even investigating shit now, they just leaning on like talk, talking shit. Yep. <laughs> yeah, you see, yo. Smoking bogeys. Yo, you seen Officer Lopez ever since? Yo, she yeah. must have been drinking the coquita. The titties hey. is looking right. Hey. Jesus Christ. I seen that fucking. You see uh, a fucking, the gun doesn't even get on the ground anymore. The uh, shit points out of the egg with them hips. Jimmy's Bronx Cafe, you got a new spot in Midtown. I went there. Really? Like, yeah, Lopez is looking fine, bro. Jesus. I was like, yo, what's up? She had a sexual harassment case against me. <laughs> I put my case against her. You know what I'm you saying? Know, hey, little hey, safety hey, range. You know, I hey. gave her that Throdnix range. You know what I mean? <laughs> hey, 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 hey. It's a thin blue shield, all right? Now I don't use shields. Hey. <laughs> yeah. Yo, shout out to your girl Ann Coulter who reigned oh in on, uh, what do you call it? Uh, 14 up. days. She's the worst. And yo, because it's a white power slogan, the 14 is like some weird, like white supremacist mm-hmm. code number or some shit. It's uh, we must do it's preserve the white, white race, race or some shit. Yeah. It's 1848. 18, it's 1488. Right. Because 88 is uh, Hitler's birthday or something. Right, right, right. The 14 words Damn. we must secure the existence of our people and a future for white children. <laughs> It can also be used because the beauty of the white Aryan woman must not perish from the earth. Yo. That second one sounds like some hotel shit. Like, Yo, that wild. sounds like some shit people would think I would have in my bio. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. Oh man. Yeah, it's so ill, but am I bugging? Like, I can't, like, this shit, is it, do motherfuckers not take this shit seriously because it sounds so corny? Is that part of it? They're threatened. You know what I'm saying? Like, it sounds so corny, though, like all this shit. Like, I don't know. They're scared because, listen. If I hear gang codes, that shit. I feel I feel fear. Like if I feel, you know what I'm saying? Like yeah. if I hear op- like gang codes that are not aligned with my shit, like I'm like, yo, this yo, this is the, a problem. This, is probably, this, this shit, yeah. nah. I'm like, yo, who do you this niggas? This is 1488. What is this? This is a lot of like Twitter <laughs> niggas banging on Twitter, and a lot of niggas in Montana banging with each other. You like know? yo, we got the illest, we got the illest fucking militia and Flagstaff. I wish a nigga would come around here. It's like, like there are 80 people in Flagstaff, fam. Montana. There's all right? no reason for y'all me to fuck ever reindeer. There. Like relax, no Muslims coming up there. Nobody. And they're out there like we're gonna. Fight Sharia law, like what? what? Nigga? I'm not. No niggas ain't going no, over there. Ain't no Sharia, no Sharia law, no Jude law. No. Nobody coming up there, man. <laughs> ain't nobody coming up to Montana, nigga. They're definitely not going up there. <laughs> definitely not. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, shut the Jude oh. law. Shut the Jude law. Jude law out here, man. Who we are now have no degree of separation from. At all, everyone, you know what I'm everyone's touchable. Yeah, everyone could get it. <laughs> no, I came, I came out loud the other day, and no, last night, and Amy Adams was trending, and I was like, oh shit, she died. Yo, I was like, that's damn. fucked up. Then I was like, damn, we gotta get in that funeral. Yo, and like, we got that one of the last flicks right. Yeah, were like, yo, how oh, the fuck? fuck? Yo. <laughs> I make sure that shit's in the funeral program. Like, yo, <laughs> that shit in the middle. The cover, nigga, fuck that. Fuck, I put, put my own, just giving them out. <laughs> yo, just selling t-shirts outside, <laughs> like yo, <laughs> yo. Double A forever. Yo. You know what I'm saying? Walk in like, yo, it's a step and repeat. They're like, this, this is a this is a funeral. Yes, sir. I'm like, oh, so right in front of the casket? Oh, bet. No doubt. Let's get it. Yo, yo. You woke up and put the wild fucking banner in the bag and shit. <laughs> the step and repeat shit. Yo. Mad logos and yo, shit. Yo, Vice there. Yo, so our show is every Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday. Yeah, I mean, like, check that out. They're I like, mean, 11 p.m. You know what? It's basically like a deconstructed <laughs> uh, night show. A lot of times you see like a white guy. And they're like, who are you talking to? I'm like, no, yeah, I'm, doing, me- I'm doing media. Like, yo, come on. This is not the TCA. I'm making some straight clothes lines and shit. Like, how dare you? They're like, they're like, I'm I, they're like please sit down. I'm like, I'll just sit in the front row. They're, they're like, it's reserved. I'm like, duh. Yeah. yeah <laughs> like, I mean, what do you think I was going to say? Is my car outside? <laughs> Yo, Amy hops up the casket like, yo, y'all are wild. Y'all are wild. Nah, that's it. <laughs> Amy, uh, explain the location of the ship's in arrival. These I can't do that. Fuck the shit. I'm dead. I'm dead. You make it hot. That's all fake my own death. People stop asking me. <laughs> yeah, no, shut the room. But she got street cred now. She does. She's good at any hood. Any hood. She could walk through. She could walk through. Even more projects right now. Straight up, she can walk through Twin Parks East, walk through mean? pink houses, doing handshakes with niggas. Niggas all be that. like, "Yo, who's that?" What? Oh shit, my fault. Then you disrespect. <laughs> no, my bad, my bad, my bad. My bad. Yo, you crazy, you you good. My fault, my fault. Hey, hey. <laughs> <laughs> start spitting codes on her and shit. Like <laughs> she starts stacking. Like, yo, 
ever disrespect in your life from a five star general. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, Speaking so. of five star generals, the fight the world has been waiting oh for. Oh my god! <laughs> Prison versus. <laughs> it's my son Jamal Taylor. Yo, if this really happens, is this really gonna happen? Because I see they Floyd say, Mayweather. They're saying Floyd Mayweather is trying to make it a pay per view event. I Yo. can't wait to illegally stream that. Oh my god! Woo, that is gonna destroy the, the internet. Get them streams ready. We gotta have fight parties that shit. Yo, seriously. Yo, Chris Brown, listen. Yo, matter of fact, we should be and that we should be the ringside we announcers, announcers for that. Shit. For that. Yeah. Are you kidding? Fuck watching the shit at the crib. Yo, y'all should have us with bow ties. Me, you, and fucking Emmanuel Hudson. <laughs> they're gonna be like, but the dick is starting to jab very hard right now. Uh, Dino, uh, I'm sorry, such a boy. Uh, he has a very strong left hook. Uh, that Chris Brown is doing a lot of front flips in the ring. <laughs> What's the rules? For, it can, is it like, is straight this, boxing? I gotta be straight boxing. boxing. Yeah, because if it's some MMA shit, like them niggas will just die in twenty seconds. It'll be whack. Nah, I, th- I can see Chris Brown doing some MMA so shit. Flipping it. Chris Brown like, like he's gonna do fighter? some fucking. <laughs> that nigga do some fucking Brazilian dance moves and shit. <laughs> banana way, banana way, banana. Niggas come wild capoeira shit. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> he gonna kick Chris Brown. Chris Brown. Now he gonna kick Soldier Boy. Soldier Boy's chains gonna sound like go-go music. Just hollow pants banging on each other. It's gonna yeah. be messy. Niggas got throwing that shit in the intro, by the way. The walk, clunk, clunk, clunk. Yo, your man had the hollowest chains. Yo. Oh, my God. And I'm like, yo, you don't hear that? Like, you're you're an entertainer. Like, you know what a live mic does? Like, why would you put the wild tin cans right in front of that shit, bro? Yo. The I'm sound surprised, didn't I'm come up and be like, the yo. the wireless signal wasn't affected by... <laughs> All that titanium? That Faraday cage. <laughs> Faraday cage. Yo. But they had video of him training. He was training on, like, a treadmill. You don't fight... You don't train... Do you train for fights on a treadmill? No. No. I mean, I guess you got to have, like... Like, what kind of? I mean, you gotta have like he cardio, endurance, up. or some shit. Like I guess? Chris Brown got. See, no matter what, like Chris Brown got. I'm from Virginia. Strength in him. That's like, it. That's true. That's it. The fight's I'm a over. Bar. Listen, you not with it that one. Chris Brown go black out and. Woo. <laughs> be, I can't wait for it. And you know what? It's gonna be professional. No dragos in the. Uh, in the ring, Dra- yo, is it Drago or Drago? Draco, Draco. When did that gun become so popular? That's what I'm saying. I was like, yo, this sounds like some Call of Duty shit. And then I was like, it's not Draco, it's Dragonov. Remember the wild uh, Russian uh, sniper? Uh, I thought it was that. I was Damn, like, and I just we, imagine. Are we watching our gun references? <laughs> yo, now we gotta see. That's why we gotta keep our head in the street. You know what I'm saying? Like niggas is Hollywood now, but not really. Not really. We highly hood. We should just go buy a bunch of guns for no reason for just to have them. We gotta throw some guns on the Instagram. Now we're in that middle space now, where it's like yeah. niggas got enough bread to cop guns. It, you know what I'm saying? But. Allegedly, you know what I'm saying? Illegally, but hey. I remember when I first, when back in the old days, sit around, youngins, let me tell you about the old, <laughs> bad old oh, days. Wait. Once upon a time, droid users couldn't use Instagram. <laughs> <laughs> it was, the world was a better place. <laughs> but like one of the first pictures I almost posted on Instagram, it was like a brunch photo. I was at Shorty's house, and I was like, "Yo, this shit is nice, cool, it's cool, whatever." And then I looked, and there was the wild like four or five on the table in the background. <laughs> <laughs> but I had like nine followers, so it was cool. Hey, listen, you know, whatever. Hey, you know, it was, it was, it was, it was a rougher time in the Bronx. Yeah, listen, you were riding your horse back then. It was out there. <laughs> oh, my. Miro yeah. got the spicy comments going on over there with green bubbles. Yo. Oh, physician, <laughs> heal thyself. No. You know what I've learned? As a I was trying to discreetly tell us they're going to pump the meter and shit. Like, but I'm like, hey, fuck it. You know what I'm saying? We out here, we show our dicks out here on the show. <laughs> <laughs> I've learned that when you have blue bubbles now, listen. It's a different game. People will put up with more shit from you. My you sister's, my, my sister's yeah. low key embarrassed that I posted a screen cap yeah. of our conversation and she got the green bubbles. She's like, nigga, why the fuck you put my shit I saw shirt? that. I was like, I was like, ah, Ingrid living foul. Ah. <laughs> She's like, yo, the note is way more late than the fucking stupid iPhone. Nigga, <laughs> fuck out of here. That shit is white. She's mad slow, nigga. Our Wi Fi's trash. I'm like, what? She should do Samsung commercials. <laughs> Just aggressively yelling at the camera. Yo, just throw a phone at a nigga like, yo, you stupid dick. Yo, use this phone, stupid. If I smack the shit out of you, nigga. That's the smoke. <laughs> That's the same title for Samsung. The Galaxy No. Use this phone before I smack the, the shit, shit out, out of you, you nigga. <laughs> It's just celebrities <laughs> using the iPhone and she just comes and smacks about that. <laughs> well, after that, why should get the wild four million dollar like yo, national check and just laugh And we're just like, <laughs> we're like, what the fuck, yo? I'll be, like, be like, yo, can you get your sister for the show? Like, she still lives in the house, She's like, but she got like a Straight private garden. <laughs> She put the whole new entrance to the shit. Like, she like yo, walk around. No, use the poor door. Use the poor door, nigga. Fuck out of here, <laughs> whack ass nigga. <laughs> 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 oh my god. Oh uh, yeah. Oh, she got the wild chopper on the roof. 
<laughs> You're like, yo, you gotta call your mother. Like, ah, yo, that gotta be some housing violation. I'm on WhatsApp, <laughs> leaving a 10 second voice message. Like, yo, my, yo, it was out here with the fucking helicopter on the roof, yo. I'm told I was gonna tell you. I'm gonna take a picture. I'm gonna go upstairs right now. <laughs> Second message. Yo, I'm up here right now. Look at this shit. I'm gonna show you. I'm gonna send a picture right now. Made it, made it, made it. Look. Yo, my little helicopter, yo. That thing that's loca. I'll be like, yo, leave your sister alone. Oh man, she's doing better than you, nigga. I live. I'm oh, like, yo. Oh man, <laughs> that's wild. <laughs> Uh, niggas got helicopters on deck. On deck, I can't wait. I, you know what? I was driving here. I passed the um, uh, the heliport. Yeah. On fucking thing, and it was like VIP heliport. Yeah. And then it was just like eight parking spaces there, and it was all like private cars. You know, what I mean? hundred thousand dollar cars. cars I'm shit. like, damn, that shit is cool. Niggas is living. That shit is cool. You go in there, they got mints and shit. Niggas <laughs> got mints. <laughs> Cause you know what? You go in there, you're like, oh, it's a PJ. The shit is about to be. The helicopter is gonna be lit. Yeah. It's just mad quick. Yeah. You know, you got time to even take your coat off and shit. Damn. And the PJ got like a bar. By the time you even make the drink, it's time to like land. That's true. So you know you gotta act like you've been there before. You can't be out there taking, taking old, shoes off and taking shit. OD Instagram photos <laughs> with the wild Jay Z caption like yo, 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 the city's under new management. <laughs> like yo, that's not your car. Yo. That's not your PJ. Yo. Dog. Can't knock the hustle. That's yo. just a fucking dollar sign. You taking a picture of the little caviar shit. Just a picture. Of you looking out the little window like thinking of a master plan. Like, no, no. You just post nigga. a picture and go. Get out of here, nigga. <laughs> like just post. Happy to be on the PJ. <laughs> My God, I'm on a plane. Just bad <gasps> emojis. <laughs> it's like, I'm from the hood. I shouldn't be here. Like, nigga, just post your picture just and go. Post the picture, dog. Nigga, just say the HBO special. Not necessary for the Hallmark Say Hoop Dreams. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, try the Hoop Dreams. That movie, did they, ever, they never made it in uh, basketball, right? Uh, nah. Damn, nah. that movie's mad old. I, like, I don't even remember. Everything's I've seen it. old. Yeah, damn. Everything's old and everything's fine. That? that was... Uh, 97... Who dreams? What, is, what do you take a guess? 94. Oh, shit, 94. Oh, wow. Damn. Even older than I thought. Yeah. Damn. I used to make fun of my man because he had a hoop earring. I used to call him hoop dreams. That's totally <laughs> tangential, but fuck it. That works. You know what I'm saying? I'm not mad at that. Yeah. You is this shit on Netflix? I'd like to watch this shit. Probably. There's a there's a comedian somewhere who would kill for that joke that you just made about who dreams. Shot, that's shit. true. So. Yo, shout out to the homie that said that. I don't know what f- interview it was or about review. About throwaway jokes. Yeah, he's like, yo, throwaway jokes. Careers. Man. Damn. I remember I was watching a stand up special. I'm not going to say who it is because I don't want to slam the niggas like that. But fucking, the nigga made a joke about putting a peanut on the tip of his dick and like flicking it into his mouth. And it was like an arena. You know what I'm saying? Like mm-hmm. the nigga was in an arena. <laughs> Sold that arena. And he made a joke about flipping a peanut off his dick. Comedy's hard. I was like, I God think that's damn. why people like us because we do, we do high level comedy very fast and at a high level. I said high level at a high level. But no, Look it's consistent. It. And it's, it's like, high level square, what? Right? It's like, well, if you go see LeBron and LeBron was doing like mad power layups, you'd be like, boo, the fuck out of here. Like, nah, you want to see that wild you shit. You want to see that fire shit. You want to see that hot shit. That's what you're going for. That's what you want. That spicy shit, daddy. That's right. You want that zesty <laughs> shit. <laughs> you want to you go to Buffalo Wild Wings. <laughs> And when you be like, what's the hottest sauce you got? And they're like, this. And this. They're like, nah. Is the hottest sauce they got like some disgusting shit? Because I know nah. there's like, Mm-mm. I'm not like, yo, I like spice. You're Dominican. Yeah. I'm Jamaican. Yeah. We can handle it. We can handle it. And it's not even like a. The, like, what's the, what was literally the last thing that you had? You was like, God damn, this is, this is wild spicy. You was like, ah, ah, ah. I never, I never, unless it was something that, unless it was like, Cause I'm not even I don't need to be prepared You know some people are like Yo let me know if it's spicy I'm right. like I don't even need to be prepared yeah. For spicy shit So I don't even like Like right off the rip I add hot sauce and yeah. shit Like, just, Shred, like You yeah. know what I'm saying I, be, I bugged out Because I, I forgot Whose crib I was at the other day And niggas did not have hot sauce I was like Yo how do you Yeah <laughs> I'm like yo How do you niggas live like this How do you eat food Like you never put hot sauce on anything Yo See, I'm trying to get to like my father's level because he does that like savage. Make your own savage, shit. Savage. Make your own hot sauce yeah. shit. You put the fucking, you like fucking put the, the, the fucking, mortar and pestle. Yeah, you put that shit in like a, in a jar. jar. <laughs> and you just got you just see the peppers out there and every now and then you see the jar like bubble like bloop. <laughs> and it's just like don't don't, don't fuck. With me. Yeah. And you as a kid you open it you're like oh my god, god just burns your eyes. Ah. You're like there's no way you could use this. Then like he comes home mad savage, put no lotion on his feet, sit right at the table. You know Scratching up the linoleum with his heels. <laughs> Got a big fucking fish with the eye, the head still on it. Straight up, the eye looking at you like, yo, really? You're not even, you're not even, gonna, you're not even gonna close my eyes, my nigga. Yeah. You just gonna let me watch you eat me? <laughs> and he just takes the pepper, and just spreads it right All down the thing. And even the the fish is like, ah, 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 
Yo, yo, scare me, scare me, scare me, scare me. Scare me, nigga. Throw some rice on me. Give me some milk, give me some milk. Throw some rice on me. Then he's just eating like a sad, looking right at you. Why are you yelling at you about the electricity bill? He's with his fucking wrong utensil and shit. Nigga's eating a butter knife and shit. on his nose. He just mixed it all in with like rice and some yams and shit. Just scooping it all in. The stomach is like, yo, wait, wait. Separate the food, man. Yeah. Over time, over time. That Why is so a... many food groups coming in at once? <laughs> yeah. I'm like, yeah. Shit turns into a stack of cup challenge. I'm like, yeah, I'm right, it's yeah, I'm right, it's fish. 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 That's the wild HD image of my pops being with, with the two small chocolates and yes. shit. Like, niggas' feet hanging off the back. Just straight dogging, dogging shit. Dogging the food. Throw mat. They got the, ch- the jar that used to be olives. Mm-hmm. And the shit is just full of onions and peppers and all types of uh. wild shit. Yo, yo. The way you open and you at the end of the table, you're like, Oh, yo. Oh, I can breathe that. Damn. Wow. Good looking. My sinuses is cleared up. I'm going to return to Sudafed. Jesus. <laughs> <laughs> you see the haze lines yeah. coming from the front of the oil <laughs> from the fucking jar? <laughs> like that shit is the street. You might be tight when he's cooking shit. shit. <laughs> I'll be like, damn, nigga, what the fuck? That shit stink. You gotta take your school clothes <laughs> and put it inside the closet, inside the room, and then close the door. Or else you go to school the next day, they're like, nigga, you smell like fried. Yeah, fuck out of here. Nigga, it. you smell like Chinese food. <laughs> you stink, nigga. <laughs> Ew. Yo, Clean your coat, nigga. Nigga, you smell why like your coat chicken, smell nigga? like stale bacon. <laughs> Yo, why you smell like fuck out of here? Like nigga, fuck out of here. Your nigga. mother was using <laughs> onions last night. I could smell it. Yo. Miss Gersh, she smelled like Yo. onion. Can I move my seat? Yo. Yo, Miss Gush, this nigga smell like Goya beans, why yo. You, why, you smell like, why you smell like the ethnic eye, uh, like seafood? <laughs> yeah. Kids could be so cool. Yo, man foul. This nigga smell like golden crust, nigga. Oxtail piece of rice. Jesus Christ, get this nigga out of here. Uh, <laughs> uh, so you're like, no, my yo, mother just made yo, it. was roasted pork. Shit was mad good, it though. It was delicious. You got to go sit in the kitchen with the weird kid in the back. That's planning yeah. a school shooting, but he doesn't have access to guns, yeah. so he just keeps drawing them. Yo, and shout out to your parents because that's how they save your ass from getting shot in a school shooting. Because niggas like, yo, you sit back there with me, you smell sit like adobo. Mm-hmm. <laughs> My friend, that's my friend Adobo. Yeah. <laughs> You talk, you're trying to make friends with him, and he's, he's wild antisocial shit. You're like, yo, what's your name? He's like, I from Mars. <laughs> you're like, oh, all right, oh, all right, my pal. Right. Okay, <laughs> all right, all right, cool. Yo, um, yo, you want the answers to the homework? Erasers are from the government. <laughs> all right. That's true. I have a girlfriend. You fuck with Alex Jones then, I guess? All right. This is my trapper keeper. This is my trapper keeper. Uh, he's just like, move your desk over. <laughs> but then by like the third day, you're like, what's up, weirdo? Yeah. He's Shut like, me. He's like, what's up? Shut up. Shut up. Don't tell me. Fuck you. You got to save this nigga you at school. Like a, <laughs> you got to get the shit beat out of him at school. Yeah. So you're like, yo. Yo, chill. Leave, yo, leave that weird nigga alone. Yo, yo stop. Yo. Leave, like, come on. You don't even really yo. break up the fight. you like, yo, yo, chill. Yo, why y'all doing? Yo, leave him alone, man. Come He's on, a weirdo. Man. Come on, man. Let that nigga live, bro. You save him, but you saw him at the same time. <laughs> yo, stop bullying that little weird, that little weird yo, nerd nigga. Yo, come here, you fucking. Come word. here, come here. This little what herb. is this, nigga? What yo, you why mean? you picking on this little herb, nigga? He's come the on. wild weirdo. He got the lights. Look, he look got the holes in his sweater. Look. Yo, God, come on. Yo, he got the manga in his bag. Yo, look at this shit. It's a little cornball. <laughs> Don't fuck with him. <laughs> that nigga forever indebted to you. Yeah. That nigga hit you on Facebook twenty years later. Like, thanks for saving my life. Thank you. Anybody's I own Facebook now. I I'd offer you stock, but I'm an introvert. And I'm going to go make love to my robot wife yo. that has the Cardi B voice. Oh, my God. As mentioned on one of the shows that you and Jesus has. Yo, shout out to, shout out to Mike Zuckerberg. Mike Zuckerberg. Was he was he a herb in school? Well, last name Mike Zuckerberg. Well, I don't know, because right? he probably went to a school with other herbs. So Probably, right? If you're a herb. It's yeah. funny, because herbs are delicious. With That's true. On yeah. bread. So oh, my God. Herbs in school are not so much. Damn, I didn't even eat today yet. Did you not? You have to eat. I, sw- I woke up and just... We've been on vacation for two weeks. Have we, you not been eating breakfast? I've been eating. No, I've been eating good, but today I just woke up on some wild late shit. Yeah. Yo, sleeping in till like mad late that's is wild underrated. It's wild underrated. No, sleeping in till wild late with income still coming. Yeah. In. That's yeah. the difference. You can sleep in and be wild depressed yeah. and be unemployed. That's one type of sleeping in. That's sleeping in like, I do not want to face my problems. <laughs> I don't want to get started with the day. Yes. Like, hopefully I won't wake up and shit. And like, your body's like, 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 wake up, nigga. Yo, wake up. The rent is due. Yo, fam. I'm I'm, yo, I've been going on for 30 minutes. I'm yo, y'all on. What's listen. good? Hello. Listen, you, that, listen, that eviction notice still up. on the door, daddy. Uh, you listen, I know you got to steal yourself to hop the train right now. But, so. <laughs> but no, when you just living in the lap of luxury, chilling at home. Yo, before we put one on vacation, I was like, what are you going to do? for? It's two weeks. You're off two weeks. What are you going to do? Like, what money? And I was like, nigga. <laughs> That's exactly what I said. I was like, oh, shit. Fuck out of here. 
I was like, "Got bread on deck, bitch. Fuck out of here." Oh, I just man. been wild. I ordered all types of stupid shit to the crib. Like what? I ordered two egg rolls to be delivered. I thought you were gonna say like a massage chair. No, or no, some no, shit. no, no, they no. Said egg rolls. I haven't got that. I thought no, 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 was like, <laughs> I thought I was like, damn, this is gonna like, say. But just like stupid shit. Like I thought this gonna be like, yo, I got a sex toy. I got two drugs. This nigga said egg rolls. I got ordered egg rolls every day. Yeah, but just like dumb shit. Cause I can really walk around the corner to the to the Chinese spot, but like just sitting in my crib with no drawers on. Like yo, I'm just ordering mad pizza for no reason. I'm not even hungry. I've been chilling. I'm gonna smoke cones. <laughs> I bought myself a good ass steak. Nice. Cooked it. Uh-huh. Cooked the shit out that steak. Yeah. Though. I was about to throw it on Instagram. But I was like, "Gonna chill. Let me not be that guy." Chill because I don't got my shirt on. You know what I'm saying? That shit, was, <laughs> that shit was lovely. It was like it was pretty pricey, but it was worth it. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yo, see that's the whole shit. foods. You yeah. know what I'm saying? Yeah. See you now. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. yeah. That's uh-huh. the highlight of it. Killed that that's shit. It, you know what I'm How'd you cook it? You cooked it on a. Pan, you know what? Grill? You I it? had to do it on the pan by cutting. You can't get it to the temperature you need because you need to get, you got to get it to like six hundred to get like a good uh, like a sear. sear. Yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. Yo, you can use a blowtorch, but then it gets a little iffy. Yeah, you know, that's not good. And also, I like it bloody. You know what I'm right, saying? Right. Because I want to go far in this Hollywood shit, yeah. so I have to be like white people. So I have to have a taste for blood. Yeah, that's so, true. You know, that blood. get myself right. Yo, a little butter on a pan, bro. Never mm-hmm. heard nobody. A little cast iron joint. A little, yeah, I have a cast iron uh, pan with, this is, yeah. welcome to uh, Hood Kitchen Talk with <laughs> Jesus and the <laughs> That's kid. Right. We have all your culinary needs. That's now, right, well, some of you scumbags might wonder, since we're getting money, <laughs> we no longer do jail recipes, and uh, sorry, we will always do jail recipes. All day holla. Now, if you can get your bunkmate to roll up his mattress, <laughs> what you'll want to do is take your toilet paper and set it on fire. Now, soak a piece of bread in baby oil. <laughs> you want a good, good sear on that now. Now put some cheese there. Now take your court papers and push them down on this underneath the fire. You want to toast both sides equally. Make sure you look for the hacks because beautiful, they come beautiful. and they will break the seal. They will. Now if you can maybe you smuggled some paprika out the Ooh, uh, chow hole in your yes. butt. Yes. Now it's a good time to uh, remove it. And let me tell you, the best type of paprika is butt paprika. Yes. Because the the moisture and the humidity I, of the anus mm-hmm. really uh, brings out the, the, the aromatics. Mm. Yeah. And, you know, that's how you make a prison paper panini. <laughs> Funny story. I was in a mid-state correctional facility with oh. one Peter Gation. He used to run the limelight. Now, you might oh. know him as a sloppy bottom twin. That's right. And the amount of paprika that he can store in his anal cavity. Oh, I can't even, I can't even imagine. My goodness. Through Thanksgiving dinner you, for the wholesale uh, block. I, I mean, I mean, I mean I that guy's got, I mean, you call it a jail wallet, but that guy's got more like a jail hobo bag. You know? <laughs> He's we'll a jail right Birkin. <laughs> we'll be right back. Uh, this is a message from our sponsor, the new KKK show coming to A and E. Oh, it's Liddy. <laughs> <laughs> yo, yo, speaking of that, yo, they deaded that. Thank, Thank God. Because, yo, oh, man, I don't know, your boys, uh, Young Sean Cootery, Brother Cootery, and uh, East Street West DVB is going to be out in Hollywood doing Hollywood things. And you know what, baby? We don't talk about that. You know what I'm saying? Maybe, but shout out to A&E for <laughs> paying the KKK to be on a show. Yo, but you know what it was? It wasn't, so then it comes out, because, you know, we, we've been doing this. Mm-hmm. I'm saying we've been doing this, we've been doing it for 20 we've been years. We've been doing it, daddy. You know what I'm saying? Remember, we were in New York undercover with Shirley Temple. You already know. But A&E doesn't produce everything that goes on A&E. You know what I'm saying? Uh, this is this was produced by a third-party production company, mm-hmm. and then A&E found out. Listen, I don't know. I'm not in the board meetings, right. but uh, that's what they say. A&E found out that the third-party production company, I forgot the name of the motherfuckers, paid some of the people to participate in the shit, and then that makes it not a documentary. Right. You know what I'm saying? Because you're not getting unbiased shit. Right. So, you know what I mean? They had to dead that whole shit. But I'm like, yo, y'all should have dead that whole shit before all of that. I mean, it was problem. I could see how they could see it. It's not problematic if, uh, you know, you're part of the KKK. <laughs> <laughs> I, don't, I don't see how you can. Because I'm like, yo, who really wants to know about the KKK? Like, yo, yo, shout out to the person that, that pitched the pilot. Because we pitched many pilots. Yo. I want to walk into a room and I, I would love. There had to be someone at AD that was black when they were pitching the pilot. They were sitting at a table like this, looking around like. None, yo, none, did none. He, y'all gonna none of y'all motherfuckers gonna say nothing so our show right okay what we wanna do we wanna show the disenfranchised people in America and give a voice to the voiceless the silent majority needs to be spoken so we're gonna do a reality show called exploring the Ku Klux Klan are you with me who here's with me black lady over there are you with me I love your twist out Boy, if you don't. <laughs> <laughs> yo, oh my god, yo, that's so ill because you know, like, that's the process, bro. Like, mm-hmm. the shit gets pitched, it goes through 
85 different people mm-hmm. and 85 different people were like yo somebody know was like no I'm putting my name with this fuck that fuck that I believe in this yes. show yes that's wow. like yo that's a moonshot B but like that's like you gotta find out like you, so you need to go back and be like yo who exactly was who? like who was putting their career on the line for this uh, who believed that strongly in this shit fam show your like, face you coward fam that's like when you're a kid in the hood and you're jumping from roof to roof mm-hmm. and there's that once the joint that you're like yo, yo. you're like yo I gotta do it else niggas gonna think I'm pussy mm-hmm. and yo if you make it it's like you wow make it, you a legend but if, if you, you don't make it, it you are a legend you're still a legend you're a legend <laughs> remember my boy Miro yo we used to, that's the roof we yeah, used to jump you know damn I'm 25 now I still think about that <laughs> that nigga been dead 20 years yo. that nigga died before the internet yo. <laughs> you yo. can't even google that nigga yo this is a nigga that tried to jump on roof to a roof and died before the internet there's plenty of people like plenty. that plenty that sucks. You mm-hmm. know what I'm saying? So don't jump from roof to roof. Baby. There you go. Do, 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 do. That's our PSA <laughs> for the BX Elite Academy. Don't jump over roofs that you're not sure you could clear. Yeah. Unless a girl's watching. Then yeah, you yeah, gotta yeah. risk then it. Then you might have to go for it. But make sure you got like fresh Tim's. Don't have like the busted shit with the no, no traction. No, no. You don't do that shit. Traction. Don't do them shits in North Lakes. No, no, you're wild. <laughs> don't go up there with some Eastlands. <laughs> you fucking on the edge of it like, like a fucking <laughs> cat on the noli. I'm like, <laughs> Just feet don't feel me now. You gonna be three fucked stooges, up. Sound effects and shit like <laughs> when your feet look like knuckles after Sonic left the screen. You gonna be tight. <laughs> like yeah, what the fuck? Wait, bro? wait for tails. <laughs> oh man, that was a pretty lit concept in a video game that well, you could just pick up and jump in at any point. Yeah, it was if, for people who had like little brothers and little Yo, sisters and shit. That was a life so saver. Perfect. Yeah, because I mean, you get to that. You got you got boys. You yeah. know, they get to that point where it's like. They're not stupid enough to realize the controller is not controlling shit. Yeah. Or the shit ain't plugged in. Yeah. Then they get tight. Now my niggas be playing. Uh, fuck. <laughs> so my niggas. <laughs> like, <laughs> like kids. <laughs> we play fucking. Yo, ACS is, ACS is just like, it's go time. It's go time. <laughs> they my niggas, you know what I'm saying? They hold me down. They played uh, Lego. That's your nigga Navy? <laughs> That's what nigga Navy. It's my kids. They fucking. They, get, they play the fucking Lego Marvel shit. Mm-hmm. But now Avery's like, yo, I know that I'm not playing the shit. Because right. before, like. He was just was pressing like, any button. Yeah, now yeah, he's like. Now niggas hold the shit upside down, not doing shit, but still was with it. And now mm-hmm. he's like, nah. Nah. I see you gotta press X to shoot the rockets and you gotta do the thing. I'm, I'm like, I'm, I'm, a, I'm a wolf nigga. I'm like, damn, dog. Now I'm wasting double the amount of double A batteries on the remotes and shit. Don't you get the. What's that for the Xbox? Xbox yeah, for Xbox One. They don't have the rechargeable batteries, the rechargeable controllers. They do, yo, but oh, like, but the kids leave them on. Yeah, 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 yeah. And, and I'm also you. wild lazy. Like to put them on the charger and the charger. I'm like, yeah, uh, I hear you. Right, that's why I'd rather like, just go to BJ's and buy the wild 80 pack of double A's, <laughs> like, and just throw shits. Like, fuck the earth. <laughs> when, I, when we first got the MTV too, I remember like we finished joking off, and you know at the yes. end, they, at the end of this is another TV tidbit for you. At yeah. the end of like every production, there's these huge boxes of just Fam. fucking more double A batteries huge. you've ever seen. In your whole and fucking entire life. life, and they're not cheap double A batteries. No, they're the top of the line, yes. like brand high name use, shit, brand name Duracell Energizer, yep. for high entertainment end purposes, shoes, shit from mics and shit. Yep. And there's always a sign like, "Yo, free for taking." <laughs> I was like, yo, <laughs> nigga, I'm a double A battery for life. For life. I'm about to throw them shits in the air and let them sprinkle down. Like, ow, 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 shit, these shits hurt. <laughs> shit's hitting me, chipping my teeth. Love, come down. <laughs> I get home, yeah. I'm throwing them in everything. Throwing them yo. in clocks. Throwing them in, like, alarm clocks. Shit they don't even use. Shit, I'm <laughs> throwing them in, like, toothbrushes a and shit. A walk in from, like, yo, 89. Like, I'm fuck calling, that. I'm calling chicks over, like, yo, throw these in your dildo. Like, whatever. <laughs> Yo, yeah. I turned on my Xbox. As soon as I turned on, I was like, please replace battery. I was like, what the fuck? I just put a fresh battery in. I take it out, put another one. It's like, please replace battery. Every one of those batteries has like no. a 10% charge. No, Scott. Every one of them. Like, you might get a good, on a good day, you might have one with a 50% charge, but all those shits is dud so. So now I was like, damn, I carry these home like a wild dickhead. I threw away the good batteries for these to get these are fresh. Smoke alarm not going. Smoke alarm like doing the Janet Jackson and shit. It's like, hey, 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 this of this fire. Your crib is on fire. This a fire. This a fire. Your crib is gonna burn down. Get out the house. Your crib is gonna burn down. I think there's carbon monoxide too. Look at my nipple. I just, I just had a baby. Your crib is gonna burn down. Did you like my braids and poetic justice? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, like, yo, I can't yes, y'all do love for braids and poetic justice. Yo. Them shits came a strong, made a strong comeback. Yo, the fucking smoke alarm just doing that wild annoying. Beep. Uh, the yeah, to replace battery shit. Not even the, the and you just mad lazy in bed like, yo, should like, I get it? You're like, how long can I go with this? I'm like, <sighs> damn, 
It's like it's, it's mocking you like the fucking Yo. like the Raven and fucking Edgar Allan Poe's uh, chair. Yeah. Like never more, never more. Yeah. You're like nah, I can close the door. You put the pillow over your head. You're like I'm good money. I'm good money. Did you just hear? <laughs> You're like, yo, oh, no, what the fuck? Now you gotta get up. It's three in the morning. Now you know you gotta be up at like seven. So this already fucked up your sleep. The whole shit. You gotta get you like a ladder up in the shit. Sleep. Yep. You got uh, now your shit is fucked up. That's now you worry. Now you're like, I took out a smoke detector. What if like a fire does break out and uh, shit? Okay. But in your head, you're like, yeah, I know how to get out of here. Yeah, you don't, you don't you, know. You like, don't know. You don't fucking know you don't shit. Know. Nigga. You wake up in the middle of the night like, like, what the fuck? <laughs> what the fuck? What the fuck? What the fuck? What the fuck? Yo, yo. Oh shit! Get my MacBook. Uh, Listen, get my Serato box. Listen, I Where's sleep. my door? Get yeah. my Pino. Oh shit! Get my Pino. Oh, all, of, all of it. I need it. I need it. Ah oh, damn! Okay. Grab the terabyte hard drive. You talking to yourself? Yeah, shit. Like yo, like shit. He's gonna run outside of the street, butt naked with a Mac store hard drive. Like yo. <laughs> <laughs> the firefighter's like yo, sir. That's the shit too. He's like, like, is that Pino? He's like, yes. I don't. I don't trust the cloud. He's, he's like, like, oh yeah. my god, red yeah. truck. Come, come here, come here. The red truck throws a blanket on your hard drive. <laughs> 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 they give that shit to Teddy Bear to calm it down. He's standing there shivering. It's gonna be all right. It's gonna be all right. <laughs> oh my god. Yo, this guy just got a new browser's password. Oh my god. He has some fire on here. It's a tragedy. Got to Niggas are. Niggas ignore you. They all skidding around their fucking hard okay, drive. Okay. Niggas like, oh, bringing right, a hot chocolate right. and shit. <laughs> <laughs> we need a bus. <laughs> Yeah. We got a turbine in danger. Oh shit. Oh shit. We got a defragment. What's that? Uh, did you eject the USB before you left the house? Is this 4K? I don't know. I don't know. Did you eject did the you USB? Did you eject it? Was it safe to eject? Oh, 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 oh my god. Oh, I don't know. Oh my god. Oh my god. I don't know. Oh god. We got to check the read write table. <laughs> Yo, the house is just yeah. fucking burning down. Fire fire is not helping you at all. Shout out to all the nerds punching their dashboard right now, crying. Just fuck with y'all. Yo, holla back. Shout out to that. <laughs> they were saying that uh, people yo, who work. Ner- oh, what was it? Because yeah, I, I, you said you were running outside but naked. I sleep in various states of undress. Right. Yeah, yeah. Like that's the worst that could ever happen to me. Is my crib comes on fire and I gotta run out the crib. Yeah. And News Twelve shows up there and I got the wild flaccid penis. Like, yo, like yo, <laughs> <laughs> they gotta do like uh, local man who did not want to get fire. <laughs> <laughs> but they don't want to show your face, so they're just showing your lower body with the wild pixelation. But it's not that much pixelation because it's cold outside. You gotta be like, yo, could you make, could you, like, yo, could y'all, like, pick, yo, could. Vest, yo, Vanessa. come on. <laughs> yo, it's wild breakout right now. I know y'all seen the gray sweatpants on Instagram, my nigga. You know what I'm packing. Like, this is a wrong. This, y'all, y'all doing me wrong right now. Yo, Vanessa Cunningham, <laughs> could you, like, make sure the pixelation is bigger? Yo, Jessica Cunningham. <laughs> Jessica Cunningham. <laughs> <laughs> yo, shout out to News 12 doing that shit. I was watching that shit the other night while I was smacked, and they do like night side. Night side is popping. <laughs> don't, don't sleep on night don't side. Don't sleep on night side. At first, I was like, what is this? I was like, nah, do your thing. Because yeah. your... the thing is, like, they, it's local news. Yep. So it's like no one's really watching it. It's fair. But you still. People on BX12 every day they show a professional and they they put they their heart happen. in that you shit. Know what I'm and it's the press, they, so there's they always tell you the news like that shit is the most important shit. Fam. They don't give a fuck. They don't care if it's like some stupid story about like like a oh, oh, fucking someone found. Like, the remember they did a story about a cat stuck on a roof yes. for a couple of weeks. For a couple of weeks they followed Dog. that shit. They followed up on that. They made they kept us online when they reported. They put their heart in it. Shot uh, the Rena Roy. Uh, shot the shot all, all of them out shot there. Shot the man the bastard. Man the bastard gang you know gang squad. I was watching. The Irish night. chick. Yeah, yeah, shout out to her. What's her name? I don't know. Damn. Shout out to your Uncle Barrington that does the weather and shit. Yes. <laughs> I saw Swift with the dad jokes. Are we and the shit. only, we're like the only Fox we're like the Wild Fan Club. Yo, I leave that shit on all day just watching it like, yo. Straight up. I'm like, yo, this yo. is, I'm like, I gotta move. Yo, it's this still because like, loud. it's, it's when I turn my cable box on, it's automatically what comes on. Yeah, that's mine too. And it's, it, I feel like it used to be New York One. Mm-hmm. I don't even bang with New York One Fuck at all New anymore. New York One feels so fake. That's yeah, not New York. It's not. That New York it's One gentrified. be like, yo, they're like, oh, here's a book fair. Hey, the new bike path is yeah. Fox 12 come through like, yeah. Yo, yo, we got an AIDS center. Yo, <laughs> <laughs> on Burnside. Yo, four days got shot in a dome here last night over on 163rd. Let's go to Amanda Boston. She's like, yo, I am not snitching. I'm just but, saying. You know what I'm saying? Niggas is outside the bodega. Three, ah, uh, ah, uh, ah, uh, you know what happens. <laughs> Two niggas was transported to the liquor. I'm not saying what happened to the other one because uh-huh. I'm not a snitch. You know what I mean? I'm going to just let saying? y'all watch videos. You you know judge saying? for yourself. All right, reporting live from Highbridge, a.k.a. Flybridge. You heard? Back to you. Shout the out to studio. my nigga A Boogie uh, and Don Q. You up next, you heard? Uh-uh. Uh-uh. <laughs> <laughs> Where'd you go, man? In the wild <laughs> sheath dress, <laughs> like, delivering those lines. I'm like, yo, like, yo, this is this is very authentic. Okay. People watching, people trying to decide if they just gentrify should be like, you know what? I'm sold. 
I like it. I, I like, like it. it. I like it. Because New York Times put the fucking South Bronx on their top 50 places to visit in 2017. Oh, New York Times, what are you doing? <laughs> Why are you? Why are you don't what? blow it up, dog. It's, it's not even, don't blow it up. Where are you? They're sending people to that one strip. Yeah. That one strip over by like the piano factory and shit. That is cool. It looks like Williamsburg. Yeah. You go one block this way, you, you go one block that way. It's, it's the hood, my nigga. Yeah, and also, I'm, am I bugging? Because I haven't taken my mass transportation there in a, in, a, in a while. Talk your shit, nigga. Is Flex. there? Yeah, I'm sorry. Flex. I'm no, sorry. I'm, on Monday, tell your driver to just go through <laughs> this so you can visit it. I'm gonna Take give a you poverty a, tour. I'm going to tell y'all like, Dojo, I ain't sorry, baby. <laughs> Uh-oh. Yo, but fucking like, you. there's no way to access that shit without going through the hood. Am I wrong? Like, can you can you come clean off the highway right into that, or like, is there a train that drops com- you right there? You can come off or, the high- you can come off the Mikkel's Dams. Wait, bridge? no, is it the Mikkel's Dams bridge? I think so. Okay. Oh, you're right there. Okay, but also, so it's you like can't a, get in there clean without like a train the right there. But but if you're there, you're good. You could hop into your little doorman building and shit. There, yeah, you know wow, that's wild. Doorman building over there. <sighs> Listen, it's, Paul, it's the new New York. Moore, it's the new New York. <laughs> I might try to cop something down there. Build the blouse, y'all. Keep there. it real. Oh, oh Jesus, copping condos like a motherfucker out here. He's falling in the streets. Not, did it you happen. see? They said Hillary might try to run for mayor of New York. She went that easy peasy. I think easy. she got yeah. that. She, I mean, she might as well. You know what I'm saying? She takes so many else. Imagine she lost that to like Anthony Weiner or some shit. Oh my god. God damn. Yeah, Anthony Weiner would lose. Like he'll be, he'll basically give the shit away. Yeah. I'd be like, breaking news, another <laughs> foreskin another photo from damn, Anthony God Weiner. Damn. Apparently, he has his Metro card encased in his whole foreskin on this one and God it is next to his kid. Damn. And it is at nap time at his child's babysitter. God damn. However, he still leaves Hillary 15 points in the poll. <laughs> <laughs> they said was like, I told y'all niggas. I told you. <laughs> Yo! Oh my god! Yo, uh, run for me in New York. Let me fuck it. She, she got nothing else. Who else is on deck? Like, I don't even want niggas. Like, who? is the Blasio gonna run again? Like, we off him. Okay, yeah, we like, off his son having an afro. Come on, like, son. Whatever. We get it. You got us. We get it. You married a black woman. Yada yeah. yada yada. That was the long con. We see what you was doing. Come on, son. You got the sweet black choach, and you got the green hair. <laughs> I think you got enough, sir. Nigga thought he was Colodro. Nigga like, fucking Broxdale and shit. Like, <laughs> yo, I love you, ma. Like, fuck out of here. I've never seen Bronx Tale, so I don't get that reference. No? Colodro, no. uh... I don't bang with... Because I I was like, Bronx Tale, oh shit. Yeah. It's going to no, be some hood shit. No, 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 no. It's the fucking Italians that would call me Mooly. Yeah, like, yeah. why do I want to see this? Yeah. Everyone like, it's Chaz Paul Moran. Like, fuck that. <laughs> I'm going to make my own Bronx Tale. <laughs> yeah. It's about a guy from the rough and tumble parts of Edinburgh Project that falls in love with an Irish immigrant from Woodlawn. Oh shit! And she's gonna teach me like river dance, and I'm gonna teach her how to keep a razor blade. River in her mouth. dance. Yes. Wow. A Bronx Tale too. Get Julia Stiles gotcha on deck for that. Yes. Holla. A Bronx Tale too. Bronx Tale Boogaloo. Yo, Amy you got Adams. Down there. You got it. Amy, Amy Adams. Adams holla. Can, can Amy Adams be the love interest? Let's yes, go. She could go. She's redhead. Right? Come on, dog. Right there. Come on. You know you need the Latino friend. And we got that. Yo, we got. Ah, oh my god! Like, when I do the rap competition, and Amy Adams gotta spit the hot one. Yo. And she comes out. Raindrops. Drop tops. tops. Yo, you oh, run to Matt Lee, I come to scoop you up in a stolen Civic. Like, oh. yo, Bobby, get in. We out, Bobby. Yeah. Yo, watch. Just throw the hookah in the back. Yeah. We out. You really want to win an award or not? Because we might have to throw like a moonlight fucking gay kiss. I mean, you know what I'm saying? Like, as long as it's not no tongue and shit. Like, nah, like niggas got it. Ah, damn tongue. Like, I think a nigga like wiped the ejaculate on the sand. And it's like, ah! <laughs> I've never seen that. I got the screen. I should you watch gotta it. watch it. It's really movie. good. Yeah, I heard it's really good. I would tell everyone to go vote for it. That's not how movies work. So yo, what you I gotta do? What like... I do when I go to dinner parties? I'll be like, "Yo, did you see Moonlight?" And I, I act the way white people act when you haven't it's seen Hamilton. Game of Thrones or oh, Hamilton, Hamilton yeah. or The Wire yeah, yeah. or what else? What else? What's the trilogy? Star Wars. Star Wars. I feel Have like you seen Rogue One? Has anyone, everyone here seen Rogue One? Yeah, I heard it's good. It's lit. Is it lit? If I'm, if I don't bang with Star Wars, yeah, I heard this. That's what I heard. Yeah, people tell me, "Yo, if you don't, if you don't, if you're not a Star Wars dude and you're just trying to watch a good movie, like this is a good movie." I was like, "All right, I'll give it a shot." I'll, I'll eat some marijuana edibles. You know it's a good movie? Uh, Birth of a Nation. And I find it disgusting that because of Nate... Pro- ah, I'm fucking with these devils. I'm fucking with y'all niggas. I'm fucking with y'all That doesn't seem like... I, I'm trying to figure out like where in my life am I going to... That seems like you definitely got to watch that alone. Like a yeah. girl can invite you over for like Netflix and chill and be like, yo, mom. Yeah. Yo, you want to watch this shit? Yeah. Yo, because you know what you makes me laugh too? Pull out some fucking Bacardi breezes and shit. Yeah, like, fresh yo, out, good, fresh off the Nutribullet and shit. I uh, was good, uh, what's man. Up, ma? Yo, you Look, wanna watch Birth of a Nation? It's good, yo. I got the shit. You know what I mean? It's a bootleg, but it's kind of it's, cool. it's 480p. You, you got feel Nate me? Parker and shit. It's kind of lit. I think that's Roy Parker Jr. You know what I mean? son. You can see the tracking ball in the bottom, but don't worry about that. That's it. That's it. She's watching it. She's like, wait, wait, hold up, wait, 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 wait a minute. Yo, because that shit. I mean, 
Is that shit actually a bad movie? That's what I really am interested in. Like, it's, is it as bad? I movie? think it's like a historical movie, but a bit too historical. Okay, like it's the kind of movie I'll go there to like cross my arms and like watch people leave and scowl at white people. They're like, ah, ah mm. you're terrible. Mm. Look at you. And also, mm. and, and um, it's not a feel good movie. Yeah, nah, definitely not. I mean, I, I like if you want the kids to be mad woke. You wake up at like 8 a.m. You take them to watch that Yo, shit. Watch this shit. Come watch this shit. Damn, that shit sounded like the intro of Bad and Bougie. When they go boom, when I hit the table. Um, Did you pick that up? Am I bugging? Am I swaying? I'm swaying. Yo. But fucking now, um, the. <laughs> <laughs> smack city, smack city. Hey, where is that? I haven't given you anything Axel Rose in a minute. Uh, <laughs> but yeah, now, nah, um, what were we just talking about? What were we just talking that about? That movie? Wake your kids up. Wake your kids up early so they hate so you. So they can watch Brother Major. Mm-hmm. Oh, and also, I watched Top 5. And, and top five, top I five, remember top five. Chris Rock did the, the Slave Revolt movie in it, and it was like mad over the top and crazy. Yeah, yeah. So to me, like I equate Brother of Venetia with that. Like That's, I just picture Chris Rock exactly. running through like a forest, <laughs> like the chopping white shit. niggas' heads off, like, fuck y'all. Yeah, that's, yeah. that's pretty much that. Okay. That's pretty much that. Because I'm down to see like Matt Gore. Like if yeah. it's just like, you know what I mean? Yo, shout out to Eddie Wong. Shout out to Eddie Wong, yo. He invited me to St. Bart's for New Year's. Yeah, he invited both of us. Yeah. But he said, Mero, you got kids. I, yeah. I don't expect you to come down there. Yeah. He, has, he invited me. He would have been tight if I went there and just brought my kids and would have just started wilding, drinking mad yeah, champagne they, and they shit. they would have stopped them at the airport. They don't play with that shit. <laughs> yo, I was, t- I was like, I was really looking up flights. First of all, I went on Expedia and I was like, yo, JFK to St. Bart's. It was... <laughs> It was like, it's just it was like, like boy, that's not how it works. <laughs> then I was like, a laughing emoji. Like, <laughs> and then like one of my well-to-do friends, not going to name her, she was like, Jesus, she was like, you got money to go to St. Bart's, but do you have money for St. Bart's? And I was like, damn, I didn't even think about that. Yeah. Like, I don't got jet, I don't even, I got jet ski rental money. I don't got like, yo, let's get them. I don't got, let's rent ATVs and crew across the island. Damn. Can niggas let's get kill black cards? Fish. My, my credit score is like seven something. You got to pay off a black card though. I know. So eventually, right? There's no, not how eventually, long, at the end of the month. Damn. How long can you go, though? Because I remember I used to just get mad emails and letters from, from no, like, Citibank. That's not how Black Being like, work. yo, Black Heart is just like, yo, we're Black going to Heart, get you? Like, them niggas will come take your kidney. Wow. Them niggas ain't fucking around. Uh, cool. How much is a kidney worth right now? It depends. Not yours. 40000 like, Your I think because probably your proximity to me. I don't me. drink a lot. But your proximity to me and shit. Like, yeah, it's mostly like, alcohol. Yeah. Yeah. Damn. Like, I could probably, you could probably find my kidneys at like fucking uh, Dollarama. Niggas <laughs> <laughs> at <like> Dollar Tree. <laughs> <That> fucking <laughs> National <laughs> Liquidators. <laughs> Jesus kidneys. She got the half t- price tag half ripped off and shit. It's just you smiling on the Half price. Like. <laughs> <laughs> Shit's next up. Ref- yogurt, you never have to refrigerate. <laughs> Five for the price of one. <laughs> Mad expired Parmalat. Like, how your niggas got expired Parmalat? Nigga? Shit little, last 10 years. Little bottles of action body spray and shit. <laughs> Yo, I had to de- hey, liquidators. I found a diesel trench coat in there yo. for like twenty dollars. I thought I came off. I was like, yo, oh, man. I was like, fam, yo, like I mean, rock the shit out that shit, nigga. Like I was the plug. Those stores like that. Those are the. Those are like Marshalls and Ross. Yeah, you gotta and, dig in the racks. Uh, shit. Cause okay, where where is it today? Cause you know I'm a little bit sneakerhead. The fragment Air Jordan ones, mm-hmm. the, the blue and black ones. I don't want this shit to fucking come Freeze. up. Basically, right now they go for like something like sixteen k, no sixteen hundred okay. or three thousand, depending where you go get right. them. Recently, they've been popping up at Marshalls all over the country. What for sixty dollars? What? Yes. So you know, as soon as I saw this, I drove, I hopped in the car like skirt skirt. Big Plaza skirt. No, they don't have them there. Uh, you know, you I, tore the, the I tore the room, yeah, I tore the rack up, yeah, yeah. and I went to TJ Maxx up in Yonkers. Like, yo, because that happens a lot. When I go to Florida, I always go to like Na- the Nike outlet yeah. because one time yo. Like, people seen Yeezys and shit there. Like, no Man, factory, don't sleep on no factory shit. outlets. Nah. Though. Not because at all. Marshalls and TJ Maxx and all that stuff, they just buy like used. They buy like shipments that stores might have gotten late or, or overstocked and yeah. shit. Yeah. Yep. They don't care what the fuck is there. Fuck. They don't give a fuck. I remember I got a Coogee sweater from TJ Maxx for twenty dollars. Niggas buy pallets. Twenty dollars, dog. <laughs> Yo, I went to a Locks concert at the Puck Building. Yo. If you're a real nigga, you've been to the Puck Building on House Street. Yo, and I you... know it was a it was a <laughs> peace concert. A peace and concert. It, it was the headliner was the Locks. <laughs> you couldn't tell me shit because at the time my girlfriend had my a matching Coogee dress uh, okay. to my sweater, and we took the six oh, trade down. Man. And I had our Sacconis, and you couldn't tell us nothing. Ooh. We came down there wild deep, mad niggas from like everyone came down there <sighs> to quote Joel Santana, philosopher. Nigga there. was doing it, and we was like, "Yo, this is good. This is like for charity and peace and shit." You oh, know what I'm saying? Niggas the is locks about came love out and like, shit. Everyone had guns on them, of course, because we was like, "Yo," because we were like, "Oh, we got stashed." Shit, and then we got to the puck building, they wasn't patting no one down because it's Manhattan. They're like, yeah. Who there's like, who brings a gun to like a peace concert? Come on, and we're like, Hey, we're from the Bronx, <laughs> <laughs> and also Styles B's on stage talking exactly. about your head in the box, exactly. <laughs> you gotta cover your back, daddy. You know what I'm 
<laughs> Stop being the only nigga I ever heard rap about putting niggas' heads on sticks and like, you know what I'm saying? But like, sound like he's dead ass. Like that girl was like one of the only girls I ever knew that was like would ask like, "Yo, you bring the gun out?" <laughs> like we were talking to you, bro. Like, yo, shout out to her. She turned her life around. But I remember one time one of her family reunions, and her cousin was going to kill one of her other cousins in the woods <sighs> wow. over like some debt what and I had to talk him out of it cause he was like nah I'm just leaving him slumped there and he was dead ass he was seriously <laughs> about to do it and I was just like yo he's my ride yo can you not <laughs> can you not like, like I can't drive stick niggas <laughs> in the Uber yet yo <laughs> <laughs> we're at Bear Mountain my friend yo there's no I'm way out here away. yo damn you really feel lost when you're out there B yo, you know what I'm saying that's, that's nature for hood dudes Bear <laughs> Mountain anything like more than 25 minutes away yeah. Cause people heard me say that and they're laughing like, ha, that's not upstate, you dick. That's upstate. No, that's upstate. Nigga. Fuck out of Yo, here. Yo, I said Westchester County's upstate. I was at my dentist in Williamsburg and she was like, "What'd you do for New Year's?" And I was like, "Ah, oh, you know, it's like you know, it's up in Bronx, so ran up to White Plains for something." She was like, "I don't even know where White Plains is." I was like, "It's not that far." Can but I tell you something? When you live in the Bronx, it's different than if you live in the rest true of the story. New York City. I never, ever, ever. I want to say I was like twenty in my twenties when I learned that. White Plains wasn't White Plains He's Road. road. <laughs> <laughs> I, know. I met a shorty who lived in White Plains, and she was like this blonde white girl, like med school joint, like parents had mad bread. And I'm like, yo, you live on White Plains Road? Where? Like, where do you live on White Plains Road? She's like, what are you talking about, bro? Like, I live on White Plains, like, I live on Little John Place or some shit like that. I was like, nah. I was like, I was what? Like, I have never. We was in the whip driving up there. I was like, I was like, this bitch is gonna kill me. Yeah. I was like, well, this is not White Plains Road at all. No, I was like, we're getting, whole I'm getting another, kidnapped. Whole another <laughs> place with new laws and shit. They can yeah. turn red on right. I was like, turn right on red, excuse me. Yeah. All that shit. This place, like, the further Shout up from New York, you, you got go, red on red. Like when you go to them pricey shit, out to Bronxville, shout love there. I would, if I had kids, I would move them there because their schools are immaculate. Shut shit. Up. But um, like even there, to park on the street, you have to have an app. Mm-hmm. Yup. An app? An app. How so, how the fuck do you like what you scan an app on a like you that download, parking meters? You download the app. And then you like you sit there, you plug in all your information, <laughs> your fucking license plate number, Yo. all this shit. You sign up, and then you find a parking lot number or whatever. Man. And here's the here's the wild buzzkill, McGee. You can only stay in a spot for two hours, even though they got a movie theater there. How the fuck? Listen. And then it's probably like some fine that you pay. You pay a fine. You obviously don't get your car towed you, because you're rich. The average income of families up there is something like 165k. Of course, yeah. So yeah. Average. Yeah. <laughs> I, wait, is that might be wrong. That might be for like a single person or yeah, some shit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That sounds, for a family, it's, I'm thinking closer to 400 uh, up there. Because, yo, Scarsdale up there and shit like that? Like, no, Brownsville, New York, uh, the medium income is uh, 19, uh, 193K. Yeah. Yo, that's... For an individual? Good. For family. That's for family. <sighs> Damn. Wow, their schools are immaculate, but their school classes is like twenty seven kids, kids and shit. Yeah, so yeah. if two more kids come, they have like a town meeting about raising the Yo. taxes and shit. Like, they, listen, we might start redlining. You know what I'm saying? They Metal trying is, to move in here. You <laughs> could destroy that whole. Like, all you gotta do is move in. That whole town goes to shit. Yo, that's just too rich for my blood, man. I looked what? at Westchester. I looked at White Plains. I was like, yo, I can't. I was like, I can't even do it. But they are saying that what happens is people move there when they have kids and shit, and they love it, and they don't want to move away. But then you got to still pay income tax. Yeah. For other people's kids now and you're like wait a minute Hold on. wait 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 a minute wait a minute like, hey, I'm not paying hey. for I'm not paying for Miro's kids yeah. first of all there's, there's three of them yeah. God bless there's a princess on the way but I'm not <laughs> I'm not paying for her <laughs> yo it's mad empty nesters up there too they just got a big ass crib yeah. and no kids and they don't want to pay you, for shit you over 65 and your medium income is 73k you living good up there damn yeah. damn they got no black people up there not yet. <laughs> Not yet. What if you see we come through with the wild fucking SoundCloud truck? <laughs> 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 she got no books, just speakers. Uh, we are not! Jump out waves! Jump out waves! Jump out waves! She got the wild fucking Red Bull fucking insignia and shit. <laughs> Yo, Mad Fire first yo. going off to Major Deacon. Yo, Mad Fireworks, Rihanna yo. with the carnival outfit yo. and shit. Nigga Jillian there doing cartwheels and shit, mm-hmm. wilding. They're like, so what do you do? I'm like. Uh, what do you mean? Okay, we'll I'm in a onesie right now that has you, my name. Like you see it. <laughs> so can I turn this to a heliport? <laughs> <laughs> it's like actually no, it's our bagel shop. No, not anymore. <laughs> Ingrid just lands on top of it like yo Jesus. Yo, we out. We out. <laughs> yo, get to the chopper. <laughs> yo, you remember that shit, nigga? <laughs> get in. Oh, Fuck shit. shit out of you. <laughs> oh shit. You gonna try to dap up nigga specs and shit? <laughs> <laughs> Sit down. Put your seatbelts on. That's the love, man. Oh, man. Just it's tough love. 
<laughs> just gotta, you know. Try to um. Oh, we didn't even talk about the the Black Lives Matter kidnapping. kidnapping. <laughs> I mean, if we if we could call it that, you can't. That, that's what people were calling it. That's so oh, no. wild. That's so ill that people that's like what, so, you know what people is? That's love like, to. See, that's what it is. People love to see like people if people don't fuck with your shit with what yeah, you're doing, yeah. they can't wait to jump on some shit and be like, yo, that's y'all. You know what I mean? And it clearly had nothing to do with it. You know what it is? A lot of like alt right. <laughs> Donald Trump Damn, damn you the one yeah, yeah. Oh, shit, that cool good, dog. <laughs> Listen we've been on vacation You gotta allow it yeah, What are you with now How you think I got the dry heat in the crib I got the human you know affair Running in the room But yo You know what I'm saying I'm I, get, I get wild coked up And I watch the old episodes I'm like, that better <laughs> Yeah I can hear the mic oh. But no Should have said this A lot of old right people A lot of people on Twitter And a lot of Donald Trump supporters Are losers Now follow me That's here That's true No no They're losers Who had never had friends before Right They've been lonely. Yep. They don't know how to interact with people. So now they do the little Pepe memes and oh, shit. Oh, yeah. Now they got that community. deplorable and shit. Now, yeah. hey, oh, you, oh, you oh, you're a Trump supporter? Oh, I'm yeah. deplorable. Yo. They talk to each other every day. Yeah. So this is their little fan base. So they're, they have to do this to keep their friendships going. <sighs> Trump, they jump on shit Trump like hive. that. Trump hive. <laughs> loser hive. Because you can't talk reckless like this to just an average person. Yes, there's people in Florida where your whole community is uh, like this. But the average person is not going to be like saying wild shit and calling Mexicans rapists and all ooh. that. And like to even, so they take like one thing where somebody was like, oh, it's the Black Lives Matter thugs. And yep. now they all run with it and it's a hashtag and shit. And so they took this terrible incident that happened in Chicago, which is just, it is a hate crime and it's stupid kids. <laughs> yeah, it's stupid. But can I say, and yo, I, I'm telling y'all. Yo, and I know I always I'm like, yo, I used to work in school, I used to work in school. Kids are fucking dicks, dumb, B. Yes. They're mad dumb. Y'all don't understand. And it's not even it's not even like, yo, they're from the hood or whatever. It's fucking science. You, that part of your brain that controls impulses and doing stupid shit isn't even fully developed until you're in your twenties, B. So you can't expect a 14, 15 year old kid to re- do rational things and not go overboard Mm -hmm. with doing shit and like yo it's because one of them said or whatever they said in the video that that, because I didn't even watch it to be honest I'm not not, not trying to watch some special needs person get beat up you know what I'm saying Like even I didn't watch it you know what I'm saying you You feel me so like I didn't even watch the shit but they're saying that in the video somebody said like yo fuck white people but I'm like yo regardless of that like this is just teenage kids being dicks, me. Like that's not a, you know what I mean. Like yeah. kids are fucking dumb. Kids are dumb. You know what I mean. Like and and if they got nothing to do, why don't you give these little niggas something to do? How about that? You know what I mean. Like how about y'all start fucking stop talking shit and start you know what I mean. Be excellent in academy and shit up in it. Mm-hmm. Get some mm-hmm. some mm-hmm. programs going. You know what I mean. Mm-hmm. That's not corny. That's the problem. There's a lot of programs, but a lot of them are fucking corny. Preach, nigga. You know what I mean. Get some shit that's not corny for kids to do after school, and none of this shit will happen. I promise. Preach. You know what I'm saying. Out here making promises that I can't keep. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck your kids, y'all. <laughs> Fuck your kids. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, man. Also, you know they just they just want to throw BLM in front of shit. Of course, right? dog. Because that shit was a real Black Lives Come Matter on, kidnapping. Pray and pray for your downfall. That should be different, right? Mm-hmm. You don't want fucking D Ray in there to run up in your house right. with the fucking ski mask you on the face. Mask up? You know what I'm saying? D Ray even got the mask on because you know what's gonna happen. D Ray don't give a fuck. He's like, look me in my eyes. Look at me in my fucking eyes. You're right. I love your blackness and mine. And that, nigga, that nigga just flicks the fucking blowtorch. Like the motherfucking Joe. Jo- mm. Like that shit. Mm. What are y'all doing? What are y'all doing? What are you guys doing to me? Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. What? Mm-hmm. Oh, is that a blowtorch, mm-hmm. Uh huh. Stop! Just burning Stop. you and shit. He's like, yeah. Uh huh. Cook that motherfucking white bacon. That's right. <laughs> <laughs> Nana got the fucking pliers. Pulling the teeth out of shit. Ah, just put your toenails out. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> you just nigga screaming. Ah! Say it. Oh my god. Say it. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Stay it. Oh, oh, fuck, fuck. Oh. Black Lives Matter. Black Lives Matter. Black Lives Matter. Niggas not tapping out. Ain't no tapping out. Ain't no tapping out, nigga. Tap it out. <laughs> feminista. <laughs> Finish him off. <laughs> Fucking Jamila come through. Yeah. to take a turn on the Twitter schedule and shit. I'm like, oh, I, yeah. I got the 11.30 slot. You can show a kick through niggas like... <sighs> fuck, <laughs> fuck it, let him rock. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. Uh, Miro has thrown a draw for. <laughs> oh, shit. Yo, oh, wow. Shout out to everybody out there doing positive things, though, man. You know what I mean? Because I, I ain't dying. <laughs> I don't know. I got too many kids to do too many positive things. I can't wait till my kids are grown though. Then I'm gonna get into some philanthropy shit. That's why y'all should want us to be rich because I feel like if we get wild, wild, wild rich on some Nick Cannon shit, on some wild Nick Cannon shit, we're definitely gonna be on some philanthropical. You know what I mean? Maybe. Yeah, maybe. <laughs> I want to give, but I'm not trying to like, because I always see like rappers and like they'll be like, yo, this rapper just spent $600,000 on the chain. And I'm like, if I had $600,000, I would definitely give that to like my old school. Yeah. yeah I would want them yo, to have computers and have shit. Computers, I, I, wouldn't feel right, I wouldn't feel right walking around with a $600,000 chain and like knowing like the little people in Flint don't have like running water. Because I, I was raised different. Yeah. 
But you know, like rappers, you know, yeah, but chill out. You know what I'm saying? It's crazy too, cause like, yo, the Flint shit. Cher is doing a movie about Flint. For and the time. shit's still going. And they still don't got clean water. This is so y'all niggas made a movie before y'all gave them clean water. What the fuck? Nigga, that's like writing a play about you cheating on your girlfriend. And she doesn't know that you're cheating on her. She gotta find out open the night and shit. Like, yo, wait, hold, hold up. up. He's like the main character, Sharice. My name's Sharice. Wait. <laughs> <laughs> Niggas cheat every day. What, yo, hold up. Whoa, what? Huh? Why does the set look like our apartment? Yep. Uh, I, I mean, just chill. What, is, what? The main character just said my girl left for the day. Uh, that, chill, 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 chill. Man, you mad loud. I'm explaining everything in intermission. Don't worry. <laughs> <laughs> but it's just like, She what? had the playbook like, just mad like. There better be some rising action in Act 3, because right now, I'm pissed and all yeah. disappointed. Yeah. I mean, shout out to Rosie Perez for playing me, but, like... Also, you're just <laughs> explaining all the plots. Like, you're leaving nothing up to the imagination. <laughs> yeah, shut the Broadway. We gotta get on some... Yo, Tyler Perry's off that, like, Broadway shit. Like, off, off Broadway, so right. should, I feel like there's a vacuum there that we could just definitely hop in. Yeah, but what should we do? <laughs> what should we do? Let's do Skate Key, the Broadway play. The musical? Skate Key, the musical? Yeah. That'd be lit. About like somebody who gets shot in the knee and like yeah. they have to like recover rehab and then they go to like the ninety nineteen ninety eight Olympics in Japan. For <sighs> roller sk- it was yeah. roller skating an Olympic event? No, nah, but Damn. it don't matter. Facts don't matter. Facts don't matter. Facts don't matter. But then also, you could, the homie could get murked before he's supposed to go to the Olympics. What was that J Lo movie where she was a maid? It was oh. probably made in Manhattan or yes. some bullshit like yeah, that. Yeah, it was. It definitely was. <laughs> that's a that's a wild step in the dark. And <laughs> they I didn't even try. They didn't even try. They didn't made in Manhattan. Uh-huh. 2002. We're gonna do made in Manhattan two with she? uh Karuchi, Karuchi. But she's Donald Trump's maid. Ooh, Ooh spicy. Nice. Do you know Karuchi? Coming to the bigger theater. Do you know Karuchi has an Emmy? <laughs> I read that on Twitter and I was like, mmm. Karuchi has a fucking Emmy. What kind of Emmy though? Because remember, Katie Nolan was like, I have a sports Emmy. We, you know what? I read that already and I was like, what kind of Emmy? And I was like, damn, I'm an Emmy snob. <laughs> Like, what I the mean, fuck? What's going on in my life? Like, dog. nigga, I was at one point in my life, I was sleeping underneath a bench in Bronx Bookings. True. But yo. And now I'm like, what kind of what kind of Emmy you got, though, for real? But you know what I mean? She got a daytime Emmy. So. So, I mean, it's a daytime Emmy. Yeah. You feel me? Like, you if we jumped in the daytime. You get those in the daytime. I feel like if we jumped into the daytime Emmy pool, dog, we would LeBron that shit. Mm-hmm. You feel me? So. We gotta get our Emmy. We out here. You know what I'm saying? But yo, you came up. Nigga, niggas came up. What, what? Make it happen. Up. We would happen. You know what I'm saying? Damn, it was something I w- we were supposed to talk about. Oh, oh yeah, but speaking of losing and, you know what I'm saying? Because I was going to say, yo, if speaking you, of Emmys, if you're a snob, if you are, okay, if there's you're definitely to, levels to Emmys. If you are about to take this, where I think you're about to take this, Brandon, you're so strong right so now. So strong. There's so levels strong. to Emmys and there's levels to L's. And Meek Mill is out here. God, for his name. Who the fuck with us? Who the fuck with us? Who the fuck with us? Nigga, nigga, we hitting on 19. The brand is strong. Oh, we right there. Sick of power, nigga. nigga. Oh, I hit on 19. 20, those niggas told me to ace. 2017, y'all niggas ain't ready. You're stupid. Niggas, niggas are sick. Come on, Ow. dog. Let's go. Your man took the wild Elliots out here. Oh, like, my the God. Wild, the Ellingtons. Missy Elliots of fucking the, All right. Uh, call, listen, so we'll get him a piano because his name is Duke Ellington. Yo. He's over here tickling the ivories. <laughs> <laughs> your man is over here. Man, Ellen's coming up your the man, <laughs> Your man, Ellen DeGeneres, over here. He's over here dabbing on stage. Yo. Niggas are predicate. Ellen. <laughs> <laughs> yo, the oh, man got, yo, his oh, his one grasp to fucking win was, was Mickey, Mickey, and she was just like, she, "New Year, new me." Yo, it's one thing to be like, "Yo, da da," like in let rumors marry for. She was mm-hmm. like. Can I have your attention, excuse please? Me. <laughs> excuse, excuse me, excuse me. Tonight's lotto <laughs> jackpot is eighty million dollars. Also, I am no longer with Meek Mill. <laughs> you have to be in it to win it. Here is Yolanda Vega. Yo, please, Yolanda Vega. <laughs> Yo, shout out to Dainty. Yo. And then fucking Meek Mill came and posted Ooh. the wild deer in the alert. headlines. Her alert. So we'll get the wham. <sighs> wow. Oh, my God. Yo, your man threw up. It's lit. Oh. In an empty hallway. It's just him. Oh. No information. It was just like, it's lit. No, no extra tea. Nothing. <laughs> no red eye correction. Like, no. <laughs> no filter. No, man. <laughs> Yeah. Then he had the what with him and his boy. Like he had his drinking. He was like, "I need love." Like that nigga was that nigga was drinking hard. Like I, I drink. He posted that early. Uh, and he was drinking hard to the head. Like uh, that nigga. And if you if you watch the video in uh, slow, 
<sighs> take it frame by frame. There's one part, his eyes expose his soul. You <sighs> can see that hurt. We all, it's, Meek, no. Meek, we all, listen, we all Meek, we don't nothing. hate you. Dog, Nuggets don't, don't hate you at you, all. Man. We, we all been there, dog. And listen, and I'm, I'm telling you the truth. If niggas was at the party and we inebriated, mm -hmm. hold on, wait a minute. Y'all thought I was finished? That shit come on, we still rocking. We still rocking. We still rocking. But right now, right now, she gotta just in cool it. the year of our Lord, 2017, she my man, my dream chasing nigga. <laughs> yo, yo, you was chasing the dream. You caught it. <laughs> then you it, fucked it up. And then you let it go. <laughs> I want to hear about your your rate no more. Your rollie on your wrist. No. Yo, and then the disrespect, Safari. <sighs> Shout to Safari, Bad Man Tings. True Jamaican, True Jamaican Bad Man. Bad man. <laughs> Bad <laughs> you may have on the mess arena, hopped on there like, what a guan big oh, head. Oh. <laughs> you want one more cocky? Yo. Safari. We got, got the goat all around his chin. Oh, shit, like, oh. Like, oh, no. He got up like the guy in belly doing a slow clap, like. <laughs> <laughs> Long time team, you come back. <laughs> she come back because yeah. we come back because pum pum slurp on me. <laughs> Pop my charger. <laughs> Safari yeah. hopped in there. The game was in the Yo. intro. Oh, it's a T report. Mm. Damn. Mm. Mm. We Yaru. Yo. <laughs> She's up on all this shit. Oh shit! Damn, I didn't even know game was involved. God game damn! Did a hey big just to violate everyone's trying to get a Nikki. Damn, Nikki's just out here living her best life. Yeah, shut down. She can bounce back now. I guess if she gets Yo, back for Safari. I mean, <laughs> that nigga's like started writing extra. That, that nigga got swords on deck. <laughs> he probably just. Yo, I got some shit for you. He got twenty meek fuck meek mill songs. You know how you a hood nigga <laughs> like to impress your girl and shit? You like take her dirty ass apartment and put like rose petals. Yeah. Leave this in the bathroom yeah. and you got the tub, but you ain't really clean it. But you got the lights off. So you don't count. <laughs> <laughs> Safari did that with like songs. He got songs <laughs> leading from the front door to the bedroom. <laughs> so, Yo, take your pick, ma. Go ahead, Do ma. whatever you want. Smash his singles there, ma. That one's it called Monster Two. <laughs> Yo, I put five voices in this one. Hee-haw! <laughs> Come in the front <laughs> Yo, yeah, Nikki, got, yo, shut up, Nikki. Yo, just do your thing. Keep rapping. Keep doing your thing. You know what I'm saying? You out here? She's gonna find her lane. Yeah, that's what I said. That's what I mean. You do. Just do. Just keep banging. That's what you and mean. uh, you know what I'm saying? Just keep doing your thing and 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 keep making joints because. Chris Brown might get knocked out at the celebrity boxing match. We need niggas to drop hot. Chris, Chris Brown? Drop, Chris Brown. We need niggas to drop heat. Yo, Soldier Boy's over here training. Chris Brown don't Chris need Brown training. Chris Brown's smoking Newports. Chris Brown got the ah, uh, ah, uh, ah. Uh. You know what I'm saying? Get the Becks in there. He's fixing carburetors. Yo, <laughs> I mean, carburetors. your man. Oh, if anyone's asking, we just took a picture and shit. Oh, true, yeah. But, uh, yo. Selfie. Selfie. <laughs> Wow, you man got the wild coke. That's that. Yeah. That's a good coke. I hear that too. That's that clear drip. Shit disappears when you that's rub that it in your shit, fingers. That's that shit. Like you could spit it into your mouth and still get kind of get the coke like, uh, and just kind of like slur it around and then swallow it like a nasty nigga. If you see me doing that, Tia want to pick me. Mind your business. Mind your fucking business. I was on vacation. I was on made in Mexico, nigga. The sangria was pictures was five dollars. Yo, oh, I tell you, <laughs> you went to made in Mexico. No. <laughs> I was about to say like you said that shit a little too hype. No. I was like, oh. no. I was so like, oh. I, I'm coming home New Year's Eve. Mm -hmm. No, New Year's Day. It's like 7 p.m. Don't ask you about my life. Okay. <laughs> Make it happen. I was watching you on Twitter. You were watching me on Twitter. I was there. I was there. I was, see, was true at midnight. I was there. At midnight, nigga. Nigga, I thought I was on your shoulder telling you what to do. Like, yo, do it, nigga. Nigga, at midnight, I was... Fuck a condom. I, nigga, at midnight, I was flying. I was... <laughs> Text message time. <laughs> like you, had the, you had the rack with the money ball. Like, yo, I was like, "Yo, this is going thirty straight shots." He's on fire! He's on fire! God damn! Wow, that one didn't even hit the rim. <laughs> Splash! I was picking up. Bang! Nigga, I, I had ad libs on my texts. All right, I was texting from other accounts. Like, God damn! Damn! Nah, stop! Nah, stop! Pew, pew, pew. I looked at it the next day. You ever look? You ever just go back and you're like, no, no, oh, no! Wow. Shit. Like, and now you I got the iPhone, so you know. I can't even apologize. I just stopped texting. I just, I haven't texted people back in like hours of shit. <laughs> but you just no, look back and you see this shit was ready, and you're like, damn. But now I was on the train, mad fucked up, just want to go home and shit. Yeah. And this lady's like, excuse me, are you Jesus? And I'm like, I'm like, in my head, it's always that they're either going to beef about the show. Mm -hmm. Most times people are like, yeah, they're. That's Great crazy. Now people are beefing. Before, people were not beefing. Because yeah. we were doing, you know, very vanilla, whatever. But, like, nobody was beefing about shit that we did on TV. Now niggas are beefing. Now niggas is mad. But fuck it. Be mad. I love so it. So then Shorty was like, yo. She was like, you know, 
da da blah blah blah. I watch Vice Land. I've always had Vice Land. You know, I'm a big fan. Like she does the whole ensemble, the whole preamble and shit about uh, Action Bronson. I love everything. Blah, 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 yeah, my Brooklyn, favorite blah, channel. Blah, blah, yeah. Blah, blah, blah. yeah. But you, you and Mero, just you guys are just. I'm just like the thing is like I'm so hungover. I'm, I'm not hungover. I'm straight drunk. <laughs> like I've been drinking all day. <laughs> like I'm, I'm just trying to get on my train home. Yeah. And I'm just like, yo, what is this thing going on Surely. about? And I start hearing like the fucking Charlie Brown music. Uh, like, blah, 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 racism. Wah, 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 wah. Safety fizz. Patriarchy. Wah, 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 wah. Safety man. And she's going on and on. And like everyone else on the train has no idea what the fuck she's talking about because they're like, they don't have Vice Land. They're like, <laughs> they're like, like, right behind them. They're, they're like, like, yo, who is this lady? Ding, ding. So I like, we get to 42nd Street and I'm just like, yo, we come back on the 9th. I just like, off the train. <laughs> I was like, I'm like, yo, lady, I can't. I was like, lady, I I'm not. Yeah. I really said to her, I was like, yo, I'm, I can't do this right now. I feel like I might throw up. <laughs> just throw up on her, like, fuck it. Like, ah, ah. So no, yeah, no, like, yo, <laughs> ah, take that. <laughs> bon appetit, bitch. <laughs> yeah. Uh, yeah. But yeah, people. Uh, you know, yeah. That that's probably like the one that wasn't a negative thing. But I was just like, yo, lady, no one wants to hear this shit. I think but she had on Crocs. But I was pretty. Uh, I was listen. I was pretty drunk. New Year's Day. You do. You live in foul. I was pretty drunk. I was trying to pee in the bathroom, and this guy scared me, and I couldn't pee all day. Damn. I was that's how drunk I was. Damn. Like I was like, yo. I'm trying to remember when it was like. Because I was drunk. peeing, and he like slapped me real hard on the back. I was like, Happy New Year! And I was like, Fuck! Oh my god! I was like, Oh shit! Damn! I feel like the last time I was that drunk was at that boat party, but it was it was it was wild combination Zans. Yeah. And Zans. Alcohol. <laughs> yeah. Yo, if if someone has a boat party this year and they don't use the phrase "nigger navy," yeah, I'm tight. Y'all are really wild, All right? You gotta have a nigger navy really white evening party. Come on. Huh? Happy people. Yo, that shit blew up and it created some of the most hilarious Fi- memes. Listen, do you see the USS Deadass mm-hmm. Tim? Do you see the U the US <laughs> S S wait U S H E R R A Y M D. I was like, yo, tell me what you think we're gonna do with me. Listen, I thought Black Twitter. I was like Black Twitter. You know, back in the day, they Black Twitter. I still got it, baby. Yeah, no, they came with a strong showing. They came with thing. Because you know, it was so problematic that anything you did couldn't be more problematic than it was. So listen, drop it up. They cooked. I'm saying they cooked. Shout out to Black people being resilient. Yeah, I mean during hostility, laughing through it. Making lemonade. Tweeting through the pressure. You know what I'm saying? Laughing through the tears and shit. That's right. You know what I'm saying? That's the difference. That's why you can't jump into the nigger navy <laughs> hashtag because, you know what I'm saying? We're not laughing at black people. We're laughing at the black experience. We're laughing right. at black pain. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? That's my New Year's resolution to be more woke. Yo, Teach these devils get more. Woke, get woke I'm going to be the human Dr. Bonner's label on y'all. <laughs> I'm gonna add that. That's my new. That's my new nickname. The human Doctor Bonner's level. On you devils. <laughs> yeah. Dilute. 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 <laughs> Yo. Shut that ass up. She was well powerful. You can use it as douche, and you can also use it to wax your she tires forced. on your cars. That's so it. ill. Yeah. It's just a, depends on the level of dilution. Dilute. 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 You have to imagine him watching somebody and they only dilute twice. He's like, no. no! And you try to use it and the whole world blows up. Yeah, you think it was giving himself an enema with the shit? Yo, da, da, da. I guess you could use it for enemas. You can, right? Uh, what is enema? Enemas, I feel like enemas, I've been reading about it because uh, shout out to Vashti, she's mm-hmm, episode 50. Mm-hmm, she's talking mm-hmm. about, she gets colonics. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Shout out to colonics. Mm-hmm. And I'm just like, yo, this is this quack shit? You know what I mean? Like, Because, yo, Vashti is, looks very good for her. You know what I'm saying? Like, yeah. She's looking very nice out here. Yeah, and she's I'm like, a duppy. She, yeah, mm-hmm. you know what I'm saying? So I'm like, yo, you must be living right. You're mm-hmm. right, you gave me the vegan fluff. Shout out to you. And I'm like, wow. Yeah. The the vegan vegan no, but if you don't know the context of what you just said, you were just oh, like. Oh, she gave me the vegan fluff. <laughs> I was like, yo. I was like, yo. <laughs> was like, the I was like, yo. Like rusty I was like, all I got was a t-shirt. Chill, chill, what the chill, fuck? Come on. No, no, no. Yeah, come on, son. You niggas know what it is with me, boy. I'm going on back face tonight. Like, yo, how much for the vegan fluff? Vegan fluff. Poppy, I don't know. How much for that? No, just wrap, just, yo, just wrap my dick in kale. <laughs> So I'm like, yo, you live it right, man. So maybe I right. check out this Kalani shit. But then I'm like, yo, Kalani's enemas are very different. I started, I, I fell down that rabbit hole uh-huh. of like ass cleaning. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? And I was like, rabbit hole, ass cleaning. Continue. <laughs> <laughs> you get, you hit all the buzzwords today, you man. Know what I'm, I'm just like, yo, this doesn't seem like fun or like you know particularly helpful. We're gonna do, you know, we don't do any remote shoots. Like Bodega Boys, you should do, go get Kalani's. We're gonna go with Vashti to get Kalani's. Okay. Do we? Sure, why not? Why we not? Got, we got nothing else going on. Why not? I want to see what my colon is holding. Your shit is going to come out with pure weed. <laughs> my shit is going to be like bottles of Heineken. Man, nuggets of weed and shit. <laughs> the, the doctor's like, you can dry these off. You just walk out. You scoop them off of your shirt. Like, I'm out. <laughs> butt weed. <laughs> yeah, oh my From God. the makers of butt cinnamon. <laughs> Yo. Oh, shit. Oh, uh, shit. I think he's doing a cinnamon challenge. Ain't your anus. <laughs> 
fucking ass. You do the cinnamon challenge on your butt. How Yo, do the cinnamon challenge on your butt. How long ago was the cinnamon challenge? That was that feels like at least ten years ago. Yo, like the bogeys showed. The internet has ruined our sense of time. Mm-hmm. Like I feel like that shit was ten years ago, but it could have been three months ago. You know what I'm saying? Oh, who shit. knows? That was like 2012. 2012. See? Wow, that feels like a lifetime ago. Yeah. Ding, that, ding, ding, oh. Ding, 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 ding. oh shit! That was not racist. No, that was our. We actually alarm. have a communist letter here. Mm. Wow. Is this Chinese? This is from China. 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 Yo, D. Zamiro, been a huge fan since the DVM days, and it's wild to see the brand so brolic. So proud of you both. Oh, shit, look. Man, inspired that you've been able to do what you do. From Australian via China, Bodega have Clancy. Oh, shit. Thanks. Shout out to you, man. Shout out to Bodega Hive. We hope you all have great New Year's. Live your expectations. Somebody ran up on me drunk at a party and was just like, because of you and Miro, I believe anything is possible. Anything is possible! It's true. It I is. don't know. I, I have no career advice for you. Just keep going. Yeah. Just keep swimming. That's, like really, yeah, that's yeah. all you gotta do. Yo, you gotta be really in true. it to win it. Shout out to Dizzy for having like mad kid shit that's actually applicable to life. To life. Because kids need to know it. You yeah, know what I'm saying? Wild. When I joined Scientology and my daughter, like you're gonna have to talk to her like an adult. No gaga goo. No gaga goo. You gotta talk to her like Yeah, Yo, no, that's true. Talk to me about capital gains. I taxes. do talk, I talk to my kids like straight up adults. You tell so, like, them real shit, you punch yeah. them in the chest, be like, Yo, get up, nigga. Like my nigga, if you wasn't on my taxes, Nah, I can't do that. <laughs> wow. Nah, but you can't baby talk to your kids. You can't, like, I, I don't baby talk to them, like, like, boom, blah, blah, blah. And I don't be like, yo, my nigga, either. But I'm just like, yo, fam, like, I don't curse at them. You can't curse at your kids too much. You, you know can't what I'm if you ride the train. I mean, yeah. If they're licking the windows, they're already getting nah, if you ride Nah, if you ride the train with your kids, you don't really have kids anyway. <laughs> they're, they're every, these kids that's is for the, everybody. That's a wild, judge, that's a wild judgmental shit. Like. Speaking of kids and disgusting things. Mm hmm. Mm-hmm. A disgusting segue to make out of children. I seen some shit on Twitter that I'm like, I all right, we're gonna fake. discuss this. We're gonna discuss this. I hope you know it's fake. It's a thing to clear your kids' nose when they have a snot. Yeah, it's actually no. It's but, real. Uh, but wow, that's even. Thank you for bringing it up because I think that shit is gross. But apparently, the snot doesn't ever come into contact. Your sister's a nurse, right? Yes. If she tells me to use the shit, I'll use the shit. If I'm told by a medical professional this is way more wavy than the bulb, mm-hmm. and it's proper, it does better and whatever, I'll use it. Look at this fucking Yankee-ass boy over here. <laughs> because, because people because in Jamaica yeah, use their mouth. You suck the snot out of your kid's nose. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. But then I was like, damn. But look at you. you were, you're like, at Whole Foods, like, ew. Ooh. Ooh. I don't want yeah. ch- to suck on something that might suck snot out of my kid's nose yeah. to pay $60 for yeah, it. No. White mirror. Yeah. White, white mirror. Oh, he forgot his roots. Damn. I have. Huh? Oh, shit, word? Oh, what time is it? Oh, oh shit. shit. Damn. Oh, we shit. Hard. We, Damn, listen, listen, we gave ahead. you that extra uncut, oh, Daddy. God, Daddy, that foreskin, we left it in, my. Oh, fuck. We told you don't sneeze so you don't catch something. <laughs> Yo, it's episode 50. 50 fucking what? The boys is back in town. That's right. What's the name of this episode? What are we calling this? Um, I don't know. We'll figure something out, right? New Year, New Me. New Year, New Me? <laughs> sure. Why not? <laughs> why not? Why not? That works for the hoes. That works for the thoughts. <laughs> Yo, it's your boy Jesus Nice, That's aka right. Jesus Vice, aka M. Chipotle, aka Pocket State Fat Like Tyrio, aka Chris That's Dick, Slim. aka Eli Lip Me, aka Butchers Butchers Gully, aka Bad Someone guy. That Might Know You Bitch, aka Young Day it. Party, Young Hot Take, DJ mm-hmm. Fuego, Mr. Nando's with Rondo, Mio Nova Santa Eva Taekwato, Mikhail Going Off the Juve Boss, Bad MC guy. Little Gunga P, Pulling Up for 40 with your shorty, aka Don't Talk to Me in the Overpool. I don't know you, nigga. I don't know you, don't talk to me. Look straight ahead. <laughs> Don't look back. Don't fucking look back. Look don't, ahead, nigga. What the fuck? Don't look. Don't look. No, no, no. You nigga. keep looking. Every time I say fuck you don't look, you look. Violate, nigga. The fuck? The original my plus one got a plus one. Don't make a fuss. Don't make it. Jesus Rossi and the Jamaican Jew. Oh, my Listen, God. this is a nice neighborhood, but I heard that Miro's trying to move here. He has four kids. What he's going to do to the what property value? Do, uh... Also, Dominicans, they don't have any tangible skills, like my man Jeff Sefton said. Jermaine Avocado <laughs> Toast. <laughs> Young Pa. The ghost of Mufasa. Don't marry a gazelle. <laughs> Young Tycoonery without the coonery, a.k.a. Chili Limon, the left-handed reliever for the Yankees. Get okay, remember Bobby. that time? In 1981, I threw a no-hitter on acid, and afterwards Bobby. I put a little adobo in the eye of my penis, and then Rita Marrero, and she did something uh, I don't want to say, as you see her from Oz. Yo, if I say Gakuzaka, Three Phone Jones, Ooh. where's the Wi-Fi code in this bitch? Jesus A. Makuzaka, <laughs> Jay Chuckles. <laughs> Jay Chuckles. Chuckles. The human Dr. Bonner's label. That's right. Dilute, dilute, dilute. <laughs> Mr. Lamarino, <laughs> Fresh Marino, Fresh Mr. Marino, Cold Demeanor, aka D. Delano, the Trapio, aka Mr. 240P, because I like my Pinot blurry. blurry. I'm nasty. Give me a password for blacked. Dick voice. <laughs> DJ Woolite, aka you're listening to Wash FM, aka your problematic bay. Welcome to 2017, baby. You fucking bitch. Let's just run me the domestic fucking shit. Yo! You know who it is, man. Come on. 
I keep it wavy, the human direct flap, you know what I'm saying? Curve Gotti, Tris Khalifa, skirt loader, you know what I'm saying? Tris Khalifa, I said it regular the first time, I had to give you the voice. I know fucking baby, and guess what, nigga, check that fucking guest list, because no, I'm not stepping to the fucking side. My name is on there, nigga, swipe my card again, because there's money on it. Mm-hmm. Feel the ass Tyson, bitch, smack me, umbo, you know what I'm saying? Skirt loader, he goes sabroso. Sure, sure. Baby new part, you know what I'm saying? East G, my Stevie B, the plantain supernova, pull it up from three, who is it? Barbellos Anthony! <sighs> Yo! Papi, déjame decirte algo, papi. Para el 2017 estamos bajando heavy, así que anímate, loco. Holla. Siente pollo. <laughs> Yo, shout out to the sponsor. Shout out to K2. You know what I'm saying? Shout out to not ISIS. Not ISIS. Y'all niggas just got kicked out of... When they just got kicked out of? They just got kicked out of somewhere. Y'all lost your city. Y'all did, they actually had to change the name of their magazine because they lost the city and the city was named after the magazine. So you took the L. Ah, uh, you know, like... ISIS, y'all the meek mill of terrorist uh, groups. Look at y'all. And y'all, y'all fourth flagging. Y'all was not in charge of that fucking shooter in a nightclub. Fuck Don't make me put your skirt it's up trash. and expose you. Shout out to Atlas Show. Shout out to Narcan. <laughs> shout out to Rebel. As always, 220 West Street Street. <laughs> Crystal clear clarity. We'll be back soon. Mm-hmm. Maybe next week. Maybe not next week. Who knows? Next week we're in LA because we we balling, baby. That's right, baby. While we should be doing the podcast, <laughs> I'm hopefully be climbing my first class seat all the way fucking back. American Airlines. You know what I'm saying? These are my problems now. Somebody in the back. Somebody. It's your boys. Oh, it's your boys. The boys are back in town. That's right. The b- b- boys are back in town. We gotta go on that because we don't need we don't need licensing. We don't license That's shit right. here. It's Red Bull. We going out on this. Red Holla. Bull pays all our fines. That's we right. Out.